And then, um, how's it going? How are you, sir? I'm good. All right, all right, all right. Boy, 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 hit a lot of bunkers. Hit a, hit a lot of bunkers. Oh, wait a minute. So we, uh, we on live, the whole world about to see us. No, no, no. I put it the pub, uh, unpublished, I think. Because Emily just said the stream isn't private. Yes, it is. It is now. It should be. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. I guess not. Keith, Keith's in here. <laughs> well, I'm going to watch my language, and I'm going to be very quiet. Okay. Let, let, me, uh, let, me, let me find the stream so I can put it on my TV, though. Uh, is this it right here? This is it? I guess. No, this video has been removed by the user. So let me see if I got another one. I sent you a link. Right on. Okay, so you sent. Okay, so wait a minute. So Hank, Hank Troy Emily. Yep. I don't. That's not a new one. Wednesday seven. No, that was yesterday. Today is Thursday. Um. Okay. Okay. Here it is. Right here. Here it is, right here. This is it. I guess it's not it's not uh, private. That's okay. I'll just bring Jesse in anyway. So what? It's all good. Let's do it. <clears throat> he, he wanted to come in though, right? He did, yeah. I'm going to put you on my TV and I'm going to enjoy the show because you, you should be locked and loaded by now. Well, let's hope so, right? Yeah. All right, let me How get... Uh, Emily, Emily might not want to speak. Right. All right, let's wish Hank the best of luck. Kill it, Hank. I'm going to observe you in, with your greatness. Let's see if I can find Mr. Jesse, if he wants to come in. <clears throat> there he is. Now I have to message him with the link and sent. Okay, there you go. Let's see what happens. We're going to add Troy as well. <clears throat> yes, sir. Hello. Yes, sir. Hello. How's everybody doing? We're doing good. <clears throat> I thought we were going to do, uh, we're doing a live pro a public stream. So just so you know. No worries. Okay. And I am going to get all of my stuff in a row here, my ducks in a row. Quack, quack, baby. What's up, everybody? <clears throat> All right, hey, let's... Greg O'Brien. Hey, Mama Bulls. Yeah, you guys can help me uh, keep control of the chat. That's even better. And Keith and Donnie, how's everybody doing tonight? Give us some thumbs up in the chat if you're doing well. Oh, look at this. I'm so far away from another upgrade, so it's not going to be worth it chopping all my coins down for that all right extra mile six viper eight gly six Katie. hornets four firefly four nirvana three malibu six what do we have here we have a viper six excuse me sniper six 164, is this the 170. That you shot at it is. Nice. <sighs> now you're going to put up a 35 under and show everybody how you did what you did. <clears throat> well, let's hope. We know what we're doing. It was nice to get one in 10. You know what I mean? Hey, Keith, how you doing, buddy? Mr. Matt Fisher, Logan Tiller. 
Hey, let's do it this way. Hey, everybody, we have uh, guest appearances by Mr. Troy Scott and Mr. Jason Harvey this evening. So they will be moderating my chat this evening for me while I concentrate on play. So if you hear voices that, you're un that are unfamiliar, you'll know that it is either Mr. Troy Scott or Mr. Jason Harvey. And what they'll be no, doing actually, is... you're just hearing voices. Yes, right? <laughs> <laughs> And then um, also um, they'll be commentating on shots that they've made or have taken in Rookie as well um, on their accounts, or they're going to be taking notes for their future Rookie accounts because I believe both of them have played pro today so or currently in the middle of a round. But I know Emily shot 28 under in pro today, which was fantastic. I believe, Mr. Troy, you shot... 28 as well did i, I miss it was something? 26 26 very nice and then jason uh jason what are what are you sitting at bro i, I shot a minus 24 in the first pro and i and i'm at minus 12 through the uh first nine all right so nice all right I get a minus 26 myself good for you good for you congratulations not an easy course for sure no and and kd yes i am the real troy but not the real troy that you're thinking of about that I'm not an Aussie mate all right let's get going that's uh Troy Humphreys that you're thinking of buddy and yes he is good all right let's talk through it man katana plus 20 percent in the um in the wind app, oh, what we have to do first of all before we do anything else, everyone, is get our mirroring app up to snuff. Absolutely. So everyone, I don't know if that helps while you're watching. I is that a benefit or is it more of a distraction? I'm, I'm sure, sure everyone it has their to those own. Those who actually use it, yeah, it, it probably does help. Do you use an, a mirror, a wind app or anything like that to help? I, I, I do not use a wind app. I am a, okay. Oh, that's right. You're a paper guy. No, not even, not really. I just kind of, I kind of wing it. Wow. Off by feel. Very nice. Yeah. How yes. about you, Jay? Um, does, is this distracting or helpful, the wind no, app? I, I, if I don't use a wind app, I don't want to play the game. <laughs> so with the wind app on my screen, is that helpful to watch the different adjustments or it doesn't matter? I like it. Okay. All right. Good to know. Yeah. Again, I, I think that everybody who uses a wind app probably benefits from seeing what you do and how you do it. Okay. Very good. All right. So hole number one. All right. Let's see if we can't uh, bust another HIO like we did on our previous account. Two backspin, one ha quarter left spin. I don't know why I've written half. It's quarter. Hank, those sound like uh, rookie measurements. Is this a rookie account? Yeah, this is rookie because this, okay. this is okay. the one we shot uh, the 17 in without posting it previously. That's right. That's so, right. Mr. Appleby's in the house. What's up? Yes, sir. Hey, Dale. Announce yourself as new people come in, please. Oh, hey, guys. This is Troy. Troy Scott. Dale, how you doing tonight, buddy? Jason Harvey. Donnie Simpson, I see you guys. Got to give a shout out to Board PC guy. How you doing, buddy? Nice PC in the house. Greg O'Brien is also in the house saying he hears voices all the time. <laughs> KD. I feel your pain, sir. I feel your pain. All right. Power two ball, 20% adjustment, two back spin. One quarter to the left spin. We come back three squares. And we measure it to the outside of that line. We then go 3.8 with the wind directional area. That's a 2.4 ring adjustment. And we have to hit perfect. One, 2.4. And I hit it great. Oh my gosh. No. Come on. Ah. Nice All right. Strike one. 
We just need uh, an extra albatross now. That's all. Boo. I tell you, when I played my uh, my baby, baby, baby account with my terribly tiny little clubs, it was really hard. It was really hard on those, some of those par fives. Just There's uh, just no distance. Nope, you're right. I shot 25 with my two lowest accounts today. Yeah, I wound up getting a 23 because I messed up on two of the par fives. Oh. Yeah. That's where I just took it really easy and played conservative, and I was aggressive on everything else. And I, I kind of did the exact opposite. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but that's all right. I mean, you know. Well, each pl everybody right. plays it a little bit differently, right? Yeah. Nice to each his with own. An extra, with an extra mile four and a horizon four, I feel pretty uh, comfortable with the 23 under. I'm not upset. Where where does that place you, minus 23? Uh, In the right, standings. Well, I, I have to go look. I will have to go look. Last time I looked, I was in first. Oh, very Might nice. Be second by now. Very nice. There was somebody coming up behind me and closing in. So. <coughs> Birdie. We may have a uh, a special guest, Mr. Jesse. Both we may not. Um, it all depended on whether or not his family um, gets home. Um, while we're streaming, if uh, he has some uh, free time prior to the arrival of his family, he said he'll jump on. If not, um, obviously family comes first, getting everybody unloaded from the uh, car trip back from Pittsburgh. And uh, hugs and loves and you know how it goes. Reunion time. Get a kid's bath, get him in bed, debrief about the long car ride. Go in the hole. Whoa. All right. So I just checked, and I'm in second position, but still first place. I'm tied with uh, two other people for first. Place. Hey. I'll take it. Miss Ingrid is in the house. Hello, Ingrid. Michael Moss is in the house as well. Welcome, sir. All right. Well, here's what we're going to do. We're going to go... One and a half back. What's up, Mossy? Hi, Miss Ingrid. Hey, how about everybody post how they're doing? Give us some scores from what you've been doing today. 1.2 is the ring adjustment on this one. That's at max, of course. A perfect ball. That should be a winner. Stop! My goodness. Do you notice even with that wind pushing against that ball, how that comes off there and just slides to the left? Very difficult to manage that slide from that angle. Very difficult. For me, at least. I don't know about everybody else. All right. Same clubs, same ball. Hole number two. So what we're going to do is we're going to hit it short in a fairway, right straight down, go minimum, minimum distance on our driver, and then take it over the corner tree, one and a half back spin, one half right spin, one ball outside on the right-hand side, and see if we can't knock that in for the deuce. Now, interestingly enough, with this direction... You'll see me try to make the adjustment of 1.6, but it'll just slide right over to the left because we're at min as well. So that's just as good. Underpower the tee shot, hit it perfect, perfect set ourselves up perfect. Jay, good luck on your, uh, on your round, brother. Appreciate you. Keep me updated as you go through the holes, please. Let me know what you did. Well, I just got two two birdies, so now I'm at minus 14. I'm about to do a, a par five, the first par five on the back uh, nine. All right, man. Go get it done. Go get it done. 
Aaron, thank you, sir. Michael shot 24-23. So far, seven account and prep for vacation still to do. <laughs> He's so funny. Logan, 20 on baby and with trash clubs and 72. All right, very nicely done with that kind of uh, account. Only 70 trophies. That's fantastic. Well done. All right, Donnie, nice job. 23-24, not bad, not bad. Let's see if we can get some adjustments here that somebody can pick up. Come on, Hank, let's go. Right now, right? Okay, one and a half backspin. Half right spin. Just on the outside edge of that hole 3.4 at max adjustment is 1.8 perfect ball ah, it came in too, too soft it didn't hit um, hit hard and go forward it hits soft, bounced up, and then takes that big bounce to the left when it hits into that hill. <sighs> it's such a delicate adjustment. All right, I think you're about to catch fire now. All right, let's go. Hey, Keith, I think the answer to your question is you've been actually speaking to both of us. Sometimes it's Hank talking, and sometimes it's me or Jason talking. Logan Chiller, negative 20 is not bad. 70 trophies and negative 20? Commendable. Yep. Yeah, that's what I said. Absolutely. I see you, Michael Moss. Nice. While you're prepping for vacation, so what do you do? Fold two shirts, take a shot. Fold a pair of boxers, take a shot. Roll up some socks, take a shot. Nice. Oh, that was a bad break. Oh, my God. Come on, get there. Donnie Simmons, not bad, man. Not bad. Oh, I got saved. Ooh, I'll take it. Um, right. Sounds like 24 under at sense. 8 in the rookie is, is probably got you in a pretty tough bracket. Aaron, Aaron Meadows, as nicely as I can say this, don't let it grind you, brother, because there are reasons. And I, I can't explain if you would like, but just, just try not to let that part of it bother you. I promise you, you would understand if I were to explain, sir. Okay, nice shot by my opponent. Perfect shot. Come on, get up there, get up there, get up there. All right, not bad. About 2.1, 2.5, okay. I think we can uh, we can get in there, inside that, right? Add the 20%, Absolutely. minus Even on your two. worst shots, you've right. been further inside than that. <laughs> minus two, quarter left, three back. Guide right there. 2.1 rings. Get in the hole. 2.1. Perfect ball. I don't know why I couldn't do that on the very first shot of the day, right? Oh, man, that's terrible. Yep, that's the adjustment right there. Bam. Nice. Nice. Now do that during the tournament. Holmes. Yeah, right. <laughs> That's what KD said. Man, hit that perfect. It's in the hole. And he was probably more, more than likely right. 
I just had to uh, not hit great, which I did, which was unfortunate. But hey, it's all right. We're in fifty first place. Let's go. Right, right. Too bad Lee's not in here still. Oh, right. Well, I mean, you know, I, I really would, you know, I, I'd like to be able to pick his brain. It's I'm a, I'm a chicken pecker when it comes to typing. So, you know, the words rattle off the tongue a lot quicker than I can type them in. Gotcha. I, I have gotcha. a few questions. Yeah, I think he saw some of my shots and said, the game is perfect. We don't need to change anything. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but that's not Dude, I made Dude, I made four yeah. hole-in-ones. I made two eagles on par fours. I made all of the eagles on the par fives. I mean, come on. Guy's like, this, this is ridiculous. This game's too easy for people. We need to, you know, tighten it up a bit. Right. That's exactly what I was just thinking what was going to happen now that game. Because, I mean, I, I, I've done a, I've done some factory work where they time you for what you do. And there's certain rates. You know, you make a specific amount of money depending on how many parts you do. And uh, if people are in there killing the rate and making too much money, they change the timing on that. So you might just be hurting the rest of us there, Hank. Well, that's what I'm saying. I'm sorry. Right. <laughs> 1.7 is the adjustment and the perfect ball. Oh, that's so funny. Oh yeah, let's go baby, get down in that gully. All right, now the question is, can I absolutely come through with the Viper 8 on this adjustment? That's the question. Or do I have enough with the Goliath? Goliath 6. Clubs, Goliath 6, Goliath 6, what is that distance? Goliath 6, 135, oh yeah, we'll be using the Goliath. Going in with a Goliath. It was actually this hole that got me both times. And I went pretty similar to the way your opponent's going right there, but I wound up going in the rough, just overshooting that fairway area right there both times. With a level 4 extra mile. Wow. Explain that. No, I don't know. It's crazy. That's a great tee shot right there. Stop. Ah, a little hard. Aaron, the gym was awesome, man. Got in a nice body, full body, upper body workout. Um, then ran only a mile and a half because I got bored. And I knew I had to get this in. So I shot back home pretty quickly. But other than that, really, really solid, good workout for me. I loved it. I always love getting a workout in. All right, I'm going to go one and a quarter. And we move it up, and I'm going to move it right to there, I think. All right, so now I have to see. All right, that's min, that's max. So we're going to we're going to go right between min and max. Two point eight at max is one point four, so we're going to go one point three. Oh, sorry, guys, talking to my daughter. Don't you dare be sorry talking to your daughter. Well, I'm not sorry. I just don't want to. Uh, don't want to. Uh, that. That's the that that right there. Why that sound. do I miss that shot? Is the question. I mean, I see everybody. When anybody's getting an albatross on a par five, it's this hole. I don't get it, and I can't hit it anymore. Oh, Jay, you've been gone. My my clock rang for a second. I wanted to see what the call was about. Oh, uh, okay. Hey, Dave Marcy, introduce yourself, my guests. Perfect shot. Oh, hey, Jay Marcy, this is Troy. What's Dave up, buddy? Marcy. How are you doing? Dave Marcy. Jay was still across my screen as a banner saying Jay joined the call. Sorry about that. How you doing, Jay Marcy? This is Jay Harvey. Dave Marcy. Right. I said, how are you, Dave Marcy? Oh, this I'm sorry. Jay Hart. It sounded just like you said JJ. I'm sorry. It's my fault. My fault, sir. Let's go, man. Don't put the pressure for a minus 20 on the back tonight, Hank. I know. We'll, we'll be fine. Hey, listen. 
We have the tiebreaker on minus 17, right? If we go ahead and shoot 27, 26, 28 here, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. We just got to di keep dialing it in and get to the weekend. And um, that's when the big guns and the big, the low scores come out, right? Right. But the winds will be a little bit different. A little bit different. Though. Yes, you are absolutely correct, sir. All right, let's take a look. Directions change a little bit. The speeds change a little bit. One, hole number, oops, sorry. Hole number one, hole number two, hole number three. Here's hole number four. Okay, you know what we're gonna do, right? Let's go. How many balls of berserkers do we have? We have 67 of them and we're gonna play it. People don't come here to on, at the Honest Screws Golf to see Hammer and Hank hit Titan balls. They wanna see berserker balls. Right? Sometimes. Absolutely, when the hole calls for it. I love it sometimes. Every <laughs> time. Well, your ability to, 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 to pull off berserker ball shots is better than my ability to pull off berserker ball shots. I seem to always pull them out at the wrong time and, and shoot, you know, 6,000 yards past my, my uh, target spot. It just rides that ridge there and look at all those bumps. Thank goodness it's not smooth up there because that may have been in the bunker. I'm hoping that that is wedge range, which I believe it will be. So uh, hopefully we'll have a nice angle um, for an easy deuce. 407 is a beautiful shot. <laughs> Ingrid saying, oh my gosh, 67 berserkers. <laughs> like right? Ingrid, hey. um, I'm going to let uh, Jay answer how many accounts I have and let him walk you through them if he's done with his, um, with his hole. Or, or Troy can. Well, he, Hank has eight. Yes. Five rookies, yep. two pros, and he has one expert. That's how Hank plays. Jay, you're kind of quiet, too. Might want to talk into the phone. I can barely hear you myself. Hey, Jesse Huntley. Welcome to the chat, buddy. Hey, Jesse. What's up, brother? Thank you for being here. Oh my God. Mm. Okay. Perfect shot. Pass the bar back to him next time. Bam. That's how you use a berserker ball right there. Nice shot. Thank nice you, shot. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. All right, Ingrid, let's go back to my accounts. Um, I try to play two pro, two expert, um, and only three rookie. But I had a new clan start, so I'm the president of it. So I started a new account just to grind for it, and it's supposed to be just a grinding account. But unfortunately, Paul, who was my number one tour grinder and point provider, just yesterday decided to take his 980 clan points and leave which then left us to only 410 points ahead of second place and in first place so i'm like oh my gosh so now i have to play that tournament with that little account and finish in the top 10 so we get additional points to keep our lead so that's the reason why i'm playing eight this time which i did not want to do but that's what i'm doing Hey, Gib, how's it going, buddy? All right, 
Michael Fox, uh, the Gipster, one, one, is in two, the chat. Two. All right, hole number five. Um, oh. This is the toughest par three in the game. That's what they say. It's, it's tough. It's definitely tough. In I am going to prove that it's not. How's that? All right, hole five. They say Katana, one and a half backspin, one right spin, max adjustment, aim at the hole, right blue ring, just cutting right bunker. That's how I made it before, but that was at the wrong wind. So now what I'm going to do to cut down on that wind a little bit and give me some extra power so I can get it maybe over that little turtle shell between those two bunkers, I'm going to use the Kingmaker. So, and we're going to go two bags. One max is one point six. Perfect ball. Ah, yikes. That's supposed to cut back in there with that wind direction. And if you keep it too far out to the right, it stays there. But if you aim it at the hole and you're in that little turtle shell between those bunkers and you're just off by one-tenth, that thing goes directly left and you're underneath the hole. It's terrible. Yeah, this has to be probably the most inconsistent hole for me for this tournament. Yeah, Michael yep. Fox. He plays eight and works 12 hours. Good for you, brother. That's right, Aaron. Eight accounts, eight times the frustrations, right? That's not anger. I never get angry. I just, it's a little frustrating sometimes, right? When you know how you can play a hole in, let's say, three of the eight accounts, and then on two of those or four of those accounts, it's just, the same adjustment and it doesn't even come close. It, that's the frustrating part about the game. There you go, Michael Fox. Eight times the fun. It is fun. Nice, Logan. That's all right. Listen, I mean, if you're not a streamer, I mean, two accounts is plenty. I mean, if you're a streamer and you just want to have fun with it and get people um, visibility to all the different levels of all the different um, uh, divisions, then you know what? It's good to have five, six, seven, eight accounts and show them. So. Hey, guys, show thanks some love and let's hit that thumbs up underneath that stream right there. Get a, get a whole bunch of nice thumbs up for, for old Hankster. Thank you, sir. Yeah, Tom All D right, is one. is going to have a tough putt, but I think he's got it. <gasps> oh, he's got to pull it back. I don't know. He, he can't get to it? That's crazy. There it is right there. Now hit perfect. Keep going, baby. Oh, he hit it great. That'll be just left. Oh, that's unfortunate. All right, the good news is we don't have to go to a shootout now, right? Excellent. That's always good it's news. It's always a benefit. I mean, it's I mean, it's good practice sometimes, but it's nice when you don't have to go to a shootout and it just speeds things up. Saves you a little bit of time, absolutely. All right, six, par five. Let's go get it done. Okay, here we go. All right, I am going to use a Titan ball on this because if you use the Berserker ball, it gets you down there too close and you're in between the Goliath and the Hornet, and there's real, n really no good shot that I'm prepared for. So, what we have to do is take our chances with an overpowered Titan Ball and predict 
that we're going to hit it perfect and it's going to end up on the left third of the fairway giving us a good angle into the green for a second shot run up the hill for an albatross with the goliath All right, Dale. Of course, you know that that sending Facebook messages outside of the chat room is the same as passing notes in class, buddy. <laughs> uh, I'm just saying. <laughs> now, Katie's saying, "Damn, I have to log into Facebook now." <laughs> right, I saw that. <laughs> that's awesome. <laughs> oh, that's good. You guys are the best. Oh, Dave's like, how long before I get into Masters? Well. Let me tell you, I, I think I'm, I'm solid in pro. Um, I'm extremely well-versed in rookie, obviously. And, you know, I'm working my way up the ladder of knowledge and skill set in expert. So I'm going to need at least 10 more. Let's put it this way. As Jay Harvey always says to me, Hank, you need to get in toward 10 and start grinding in toward 10 to get the practice you need to be in expert and then graduate to master. So we'll just leave it at that. I need to do a better job of, you know, making some time during the week and grinding a tour 10 account so that I get the experience necessary to move up and start winning some expert tournaments. I absolutely agree with you, Gib. Masters is a whole new ball game, sir. Yes, sir. Come on, stay on that left side. That a boy. That's exactly the position that I consider to be A1. Thank you, sir. And I'll try to show you why. Because what we're going to do is we're going to try to take it over on the left-hand side near that bunker. There seems to be a flat area over there which lets the ball guy just go straight up the hill with a goliath versus kind of having to manipulate it left or right over on the right-hand side of that uphill fairway. So hopefully we'll be able to show you that here in just a second. First of all, do this. All right, min there, max there. So this is most like medium. Okay, see how that just goes straight up the hill right there? Right there, just move it right there. You can manipulate it to whichever way you want. So that is straight up the hill, just left of the cup. I'm gonna go medium distance or mid distance at 2.9 is 1.2. So 1.2 is like right there. See if we can't get this in the hole. Ah, I hit it great. great shot. I purposely tried to hit it late perfect, and I hit it great, and it went in the hole anyway. Bam! Did you, did you get the albatross? Oh, I just got an albatross great ball. Nice. Woo! Nice shot. Let's see that one, two, three, eagle for all time's sake. Oh, right? Right? One, two, three, go! Okay, okay, Bam! All right, all right, all right. Okay. That's right, that's right. Bam! All right. And give no, that Troy is uh, Troy Humphreys. That's a different Troy. All right, now we. This is the. It, it, if you ask me, this is so hard because it it feels like it should be so easy. You know what I mean? The whole number five, which is very difficult, par three. I can understand why it's very difficult and you can't make it. So I have no expectations. But here, I expect to make this shot, and I can't. It's super frustrating. Michael Fox, that is beautiful. Hank, we're just going to start calling these bullies, bro. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. <laughs> That's beautiful. That's beautiful. <laughs> Bully booms. Come on. That's right, Correct. Man. Correct, Gib. 
correct. Kick it. Bam, bam, bam. Okay. Um, 10%. I really want to try a kingmaker here. Unnecessary, but I'm going to do it. Troy, Mike, Michael Fox asked you a question about streaming. I already, I already answered him. Okay. He's my uh, Troy's calling Michael Gibb. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Mike, Michael Fox is affectionately known as Gibb. Okay. Okay. All right. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do 10% with the Kingmaker, half top, half top spin, a quarter top spin, and I'm going to do a quarter left spin, and I'm going to put it towards the first third of the light square on the green after that second bounce or where it's sec the bounce the second bounce occurred because i'm trying to get a little bit more speed and strength in my trajectory so that the ball actually keeps its line versus slowing down and going to the right Right there. Okay. 2.2 .2 is 1.1. 1 .1. Okay. Gibster, his name is Jason Harvey. Come on now. Perfect shot. I put a little tweak of to the left as well. Ah, it's going to be to the right still. Oh, look at that ball. You are so mean. <sighs> oh, goodness gracious. Oh, come on, man. Come on. You're trying to get a minus 35. I don't know how to make that shot. I don't. So if anybody has the directions in Rookie on how to make that hole-in-one other than putting full top spin, not full top spin, but one full top spin on and landing it further on the green so it takes a straight hop, then let me know. But I I don't want it to go, you know, four squares past the hole, you know, at three miles an hour. And if it hits the stick, it's going to bounce off like this guy. What? See how far that goes? Right next to the hole. <laughs> I love getting made as fool of. All right, Hank, we got a drop on. Uh, we got a drop coming on eight, though. No ifs, ands, or buts about it. Oh, for sure. Uh, we're going. Uh, we're going berserk again. You're Mike, right, Hank, Dale. Make sure you Mike get a hold oh, of yep, one there you on go. eight. We do need a little bit more jovial spiriting in the stream. Absolutely, totally agree, sir. I appreciate you being here, though, Dale. Absolutely. Absolutely. I got to do another account after this. That's what's even crazier. So, Gibster's saying use the backbone with no spin at all. Put your first bounce just past the fringe. Hmm. Where does he line up on the, uh, on the green with that, Gib? Max is 1.9 rings here. A perfect ball. Oh man, that I is. I believe it was 2.2 miles per hour there, Gib. That is in the hole every single time. Man. Oof. Close, Hank. Yep. This back nine is going to be special, but we're going to get it started on hole number eight. Hole number eight, these last 
These okay. last 11 holes is where the magic is. Let's go. Let's go, Hank. Come on, cheerleader. Yes, Gib. Yes. Well, Logan says get close every time. I can get close with what I'm doing, right? I want an adjustment that goes in. <laughs> Ashley Forge, yes. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Welcome to the stream. I love the good lucks. Thank you so much. I, you know what? I want to, I want to. Oh, that just sounds so conceited. <laughs> we'll just keep quiet. All the more reason we need to hear it, hey? <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I need a berserker with a six. No, only if you're trying to get the hole in one. No, well, I'm not going to do that because I can't get to the green. All right, Gip. So Hank Gibb is saying um, on that hole, use the backbone and uh, no spin whatsoever and line up just to the right of the hole and set your second bounce just on the other side of the fringe on seven, which is extremely close to what you've been doing. Yep. One half left spin this wind. First bounce on square of the green. Line it up so it looks like it's in and move a square to the right. Max adjust 0%. Huh. All right. Nice. Thank you, Dale. I'll have to go back to the stream and pause it on that, uh, that little explanation. And... Uh, hey, Rabito. is 1.8 at that angle is roughly right there you know Gib started off like that it's kind of scary you know no just want, just want to let no you know. no <laughs> no oh, <I> see. <laughs> So the Gipster says he's got better advice, Hank. He says, just dunk it with the big dog. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right? I love it. I love it. Great advice. Great advice. God bless America. Can you believe I did that just now? That takes me right out of the running for an easy eagle. We're not out of not making it. It's just it's going to be difficult. What rough iron do you have? Um, uh, oh boy, I have no idea. It says I have a Razor 1 on, which, um, if that's the case, we're in trouble. Hank, Hank, you going for a 31. You going to do something special on the back. All right, bro. All right. All right. Thank you. I like it. But, but we still got the weekend. Oh, we yeah, yeah. That's why I'm not worried about this, man. This is, this is great. Let, let's make sure we get it. Oh, we have the Nirvana 3. Oh no, you're still gonna be in front. Oh of yeah, that. you're good. And Hank, there is a question about the uh, level of sound. I think they're requesting possibly to turn it up a little bit if you have the ability. Yep, sure, thanks. is this point eight. Perfect shot. It looks like I'm playing with Hank. This guy's got so much gold. Hmm. Come on! Ah! Nice. I can tell what that sound means. Oh, that's beautiful. And he did it at the buzzer. He did a buzzer beater 
Nice save for Eagle right there. Beautiful, beautiful. The buzzer beater. Tell me what does that mean when you make shots like that? That's how you bring the gold home. That's right, baby. That is banner-esque. The buzzer beater. Ha-ha! <laughs> wow. Man, those are the shots when you are like you're almost out of it, right? And you come back and make them. Those are absolutely better than riddle of the fairway and you make an albatross, right? Because they're that much more difficult to me, for me. I don't know about anybody else. Let's watch it one more time. And I didn't even have the right club in the bag. I had to switch in my app. Oh, I barely got it in there, too. Woo! All right, everybody. Thank you. Thank you, Dave. Thank you, Robert. Michael, Wake thank up. you. Thank you, Mr. Fox, Mr. Moss. Let's go gold hunting. That's right. KD, bam. <laughs> Thanks, Logan. Appreciate that, buddy. That is a momentum boost. That is correct. Bam. All right, all right, all right. Let's go. That helped. That helped. Oh, so. With all those misses, we can still get 15. That's pretty good. Yep, it's definitely pretty good. We missed one, we missed seven, we missed, no, we did make the albatross on three, that's right. No, on f six, so that was good. 26 under on expert, actually, that's awesome. Really? Wow. Yeah, Ashley's a, Ashley's a, a slinger, she's a ball slinger, that's yeah, for sure. Yeah, no kidding, well done. Woo, beauty. Gibbs says he shot a 28 in pro. Nice. Very nice. Nice, Mike. Oh. All right. Full top, three right. Um, 1.4 is the adjustment for the wind. 1.4. Perfect shot. perfect shot as we said his hair is perfect oh don't make me start quoting werewolves of london again yeah nobody brother. got my jokes yeah, last time yeah, <laughs> all right we've got on the x on the viper uh, we got viper eight now rough bump we're gonna go two and a half back we're gonna go edge of the hole mid adjustment more than likely and maybe do a half a spin to the left. So we got to do all of that in less than 30 seconds. Well, your opponent's in the same boat that I am <coughs> with the clubs. And he's, playing, will, and he's playing basic ball. Right, right. <laughs> How about Dave Marcy? I love Dave Marcy. That is so funny. When you see on the Jay, I, can, in your bracket. I didn't hear anything that you said, man. I heard you talking, but I can't hear what you're saying. You're too far away from the phone. I said I had to do, I had to use a power four ball to be able to do the rough bump in pro on hole nine. Understood. Yeah, I actually was able to get by with the Titan myself, but yeah. Not sure. I'm not sure how anybody could use such low-level clubs. I mean, like I said, on my baby, it's the baby account. It's an extra mile four and a horizon four. And there's just no way to reach that green with a white ball in two. 
just no way to do it. Not and, and at least not leave yourself a good approach with only one backspin from the horizon forward. Perfect shot. Oh, right, Dave Marcy. I can see. I can see what you're saying there. I haven't been uh, quite so lucky or unlucky, if you will, as of yet. But I'm sure it's going to come one day. Thank you, Archer. Thank you. <laughs> Michael Fox. I love it. You I got can't. Three I... drops, though. Minus 15. Oh, yep. I don't recall what happened in our pro bracket, um, Michael. I up my my mic volume so it might echo a teeny bit. So I'm gonna keep it back a little bit from my voice. So hopefully it will resonate clearly without any echo, and you'll still hear me. Ashley, uh, the one voice is Jay Harvey, and you know me. It's Troy. I wonder if they can hear me okay. Probably. I'll just keep talking up. I, I raised your guys' desktop audio to be up a little bit higher as well, so they'll probably be able to hear you a little bit better as well. Hopefully. All right. This is the one we talked about. I have a kingmaker on. Um, this Michael is... Moss says he can't really hear any of us. Oh, really? Yikes. Well, I turn. All right, start talking into your mic. I am talking into my mic. Hello, <laughs> hello, right, hello. Well. hello. Okay. Well, I turned you got your mic volumes up really pretty significantly. Hopefully, they'll be able to hear you. And one half. Ashley, that's a good idea. That's that's what I do every time as well. And I'm gonna put it right there, but over the over that hump this time, and like that, and it's gonna fly in there this time. Ashley, that's a good idea. That's that's what and I. And that's do. one point one. Dave Marcy says he's watching us at the movie theaters. Nice. All right, come on now. Let me see this adjustment be good. Oh, that's way right still. Dave mm. Marcy says he's watching us at the movie theaters. Interesting. You know, right. I think you had you were you were on to something earlier when you said and obviously you're not going to remember which hole it was, but when you were playing this one in a shootout a little while ago, that guy went straight at the hole, and it was, you know, coming in hot. And and you, you know, mentioned that you thought that might be the best way to do it. Yeah, I Don't really give it a chance to undulate across that green. Just go straight for the hole. Yeah, with some force. You know, maybe we'll, if we get some more shootouts with this, we'll try that. You know what I mean? I do. Instead of trying it dur during the tournament hole, I hate to excuse me, give up on our adjustments that are so close to being tweaked to the to the nth degree. All right, so here we go. Um, we're gonna go katana, Goliath, two backspin, one quarter left spin. Plus 20% in your adjustment or in your wind app. And then three squares short of the hole with the ball guide to the left of the line that separates the dark squares and the light square. And should be pretty close to going in the hole, if not in the hole, each and every time. And that works with Goliath 4, 5, and 6. Let's go. 
Look at that swing. Wow. Let's go. Two back. One quarter left. Look at the 20%. is the number to adjust. Perfect ball. We need this to go in. Nope. Too hard. Left it out there, my friend. Is it just me, or does it look like that thing took a little curve to the left just before it got to the hole? It sure did look like it was going straight at the hole and then just curved left. All right, how about if I just speak up louder, and I've, uh, I'll just move my voice up to the microphone again to speak louder. I moved my microphone down because um, I was getting that echo, and when I moved there... Desktop audio adjustments up. That obviously is going to cause an echo. You know what? I just, I just pull back a little bit more power, and, uh, and I think I had it aimed a little bit too far to the left of that uh, original alignment spot. So. I just think my alignments were off, that's all. Totally my own. You can't hit it perfect and in the hole each and every time. This doesn't work. All right, here's the one. Well, tell that to the guy that shot 17 under through eight holes, or through nine holes. Yeah, right. <laughs> Was I had the power three uh, ball in me in my app up instead of the power two, so that didn't help either. So that added a number, you know, at least a point one to the left. Do you by chance have your uh, computer on? Like, are you listening to the stream on your computer, or maybe it's no. Jay? No. Maybe it's Jay. Because I'm hearing that echo. Oh, Jesse sent me a message. All right, I'll be right there, buddy. Well, thank you, Ashley. I like my radio sounding voice as well. Now, news from our sponsors. Nice shot by my opponent. Perfect ball. See what happens here. Get in a hole. Now we got it to the left because we aimed it too far on purpose to the left to see if we could change the maneuver. Hey, Jesse's in the chat. <laughs> He's grilling for his wife. I love it. <laughs> Ooh, yes, that look good. Steak kebabs. Very nice. Hey, hey Jesse, thanks, thanks, man. You're, uh, I love, love your, your pictures, pictures, man. And the steak kebabs look amazing. Oh, Ingrid, thank you. Before you got in the stream, 
I was asking my colleagues that were on the, uh, the phone with me what they thought of the, the the setup with the notebook and whether or not it was a positive thing for people in the stream to watch or was it more of a nuisance or was it too distracting and you know Jay says he likes it because he uses the notebook app and then Troy said he doesn't really bother him because he uses his own adjustments from knowledge of the game so which may be the reason why I only have two gold banners and you have 2,000 gold banners. I'm not saying, I'm just saying. 76, sir. Excuse me, excuse me, I was off by a couple. And, and they, they are all gold. gold. Come, Come on, most, most of them are, are, but I got, I got some, some silver and bronze, bronze that, you know, sprinkled, sprinkled in here. Look at just walk in yeah, sure. Were you out there? Oh, from, from the garden. Wow, very, very nice squash, tomatoes. <laughs> got some nice um, some steak. Um, I don't even know what you call them. Medallions, it look like. And you put them all on the grill, man. It looks wonderful. It's fantastic. Oh. I Thank had, you, Michael uh, Moss. I had stir fried chicken, chicken tonight for dinner. dinner. How about that? Mm, that sounds good. It was. It was really good, actually. I think, I think Jesse, Jesse had a beer in his hand, too, though. though. That's what's, what's really frustrating. frustrating. <laughs> you still off? You still not drinking the beer? Mm. Gotta stay away from those carbs. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. It's, it's the... Uh, Blue can, but, but it's, it's a, a bottle. bottle. The, the blue, blue bottle club. Uh, we, we know, know what, what we're doing here, right? Everybody knows we just move it over a little bit for the wind adjustment. And all we do is hit it under power a little bit. And it is perfect. Goes down the middle. And we set up for our second shot, which will be one and a half backspin, a half right spin, one and a half ball out to the right side of the cup. And maybe this time it'll go in. G-Man's in the house, what's, what's up? Michael Moss just told me I have a face for radio. <laughs> oh, oh, stuff peppers, peppers. Jesse, Jesse, that, that is, is my second, sec well, well, third, I, I shouldn't say, say second. second. Third ultimate, most amazing meal ever. ever. Stuff peppers, peppers is three. A really nice roast with onions and um, peppers and carrots, carrots along with mashed potatoes and gravy is my second and then of course my all time favorite would be Thanksgiving feast you know I'm not the hugest fan of a baked turkey I would much rather go for the ham oh well, there you go well, well I mean everybody has a, 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 a variety at Thanksgiving depending on their, their family traditions and their heritage etc so well, the family always did the turkey, but, you know, um, I think after a few years of me fussing, saying, please, Mommy, you know, as a little kid, can you do a ham for Christmas? It, it got to the point to where she would do a, do a turkey and a ham. So, right. and of course, our, our dogs never fussed about that. Max is 1.9. Perfect again. Now let's see it hit and go up the hill and go to the left again. Of course. God bless America. That was a good one, and maybe just over one ball out to the right hand side of that hole, and it still went to the left. I think they changed something from the uh, qualifying to the opening round, and I can't remember who it was that I saw had posted this on Facebook, but there was somebody else who had made mention of the same thing. It might have been Michael. It might have been MBS. Said that he thought that they had made a few changes from uh, qualifying round to opening round. What do you think? Well, well, I, I think, think they, they make, make little, little tweaks and twinges, twinges all the time in all, all the, the different, different rounds. 
Um, hey, hey G-Man, G-Man, we have um, as guests right, right now uh, Troy Scott, who's going the majority What's up? of the talking. And then we <laughs> also have Jay Harvey, who's in the background, who's currently on, I believe, probably whole 17 or 18 in his pro account. So, so he's, he's in the background, background uh, trying, trying to finish, finish up that grind. Um, but he's in the background. At some point, he'll uh, make an adjustment or speak up, cheer, whatever. Say hi to the clan or the group, Jay. One one two two one three one two two. All right. What's up, G man? My man, man, Jamil. How you doing, buddy? We need to make that Alba again here. Man, Jamil, wishing you good luck, Hammer. Man, what is up, my friend? Welcome to the stream. Awesome. Thank you for being here, sir. Hammer time. Let's go. Come on, I need the three here. I'm going to go back to the Golf Clash notebook real quick for clubs and go to Woods and go to the Viper 8, which has 170, and the Sniper... What do I have in the bag? Sniper's a 7, isn't it? No, it's a 6. six? Okay. Sniper 6 is what? 164? Mm. But you know what? I don't play either one of them because I'm using the. But can I hit it so far? I'm using the. Um, I'm using the Goliath, so it doesn't matter on this hole. Hank, I'll be right back, buddy. Gotta take a bathroom break. If I hit it short and goes, hits that rough, and then just flies out. Uh, we got a bathroom break, we got somebody playing the game, and now you have me having to do the chat again. All right, putting the B-52 in the bags, taking out the Goliath for Dave. Never use it, so I'm not a curve. It's at a four. Okay. Logan's going back to Gib. I'm back. That's right, Jesse. Unless you bounce in that rough and roll out. But we have a six, so we shouldn't have that hurting us at this point. Point five is a one point two adjustment. Perfect ball. That should hit uh, semi close to the rough. Give us plenty of trajectory to get over that and down into that fairway, which should give us a eh, probably close to max. Oh man. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, Jay's back in the house, everybody. How'd you finish up, bro? Minus twenty four. I gotta I gotta get another hole in one on a pro. It's gotta happen. Did you gotta get happen. did you get one tonight? No, I haven't got a hole in one on in pro this uh not in not in this Quite tournament, fine, okay. Not in open, but I, but I need one. I, I'm getting close, but it's a big difference between great and uh, perfect for those hole in ones for those part threes. And I think I might have to go back to a power three ball for hole number four. I was using a power forward ball tonight, the stallion ball, so I wouldn't have to use any uh so I wouldn't have to use that uh max adjust. I'm not a fan of max adjust, but it's cool though, but it's leaving my it's leaving my second shot 
where I just can't roll it in because it's got so much power with that power four that you need to, I'm going to either have to keep using a power four and put a bar, one bar backspin on the second shot for four because in this tournament, you need, uh, you got to get two of those par fours. You have to get two par fours. On each side. Exactly. Exactly. Well, I need to do that because I definitely cannot hit any of these uh, albatrosses on these par fives. Just when I have it, I think I have it lined up right, I hit it great. When I think I have it, uh, I don't hit it great, I don't have it lined up, and I miss slightly to the left or to the right. So. Ah, super frustrating. All right, boss, I'm back. All right, sir. Welcome back. Hey, everybody in the chat, do uh, do Hank a favor. We got 26 people watching and only 13 thumbs up. Let's see if we can fix that. Smash them. Thank you. Hey Hank, I, 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 you know, I, of course I took a bathroom break. Did you by chance see Jesse's last uh, last comment? No, what was it? He uh, suggested you look into setting up a Discord room. He said it'll help your audio come through clearer when having a group of people in your voice chat. Oh, perfect. I'm assuming that is something digital. Discord room. I know what he's talking about. Usually I don't post these, right? So it's true. It's very true. So they're really, you know, we just talk amongst ourselves and then we just have to stream off and it's over. So, but it, it's a good thing. Smart idea. Thank you, sir. Well, Jesse, he already acknowledged me. I gave him a thumbs up uh, for his great rookie pro through. But since uh, I'm here, I want to say once again, J Bone, that was an awesome rookie playthrough. I'm looking forward to playing my rookie tomorrow and trying to duplicate some of those great shots. Nice. H Hank is one of a kind. Hank is going to use balls and do shots that. I'm not trying to duplicate, but Hank is an awesome rookie player. I just, I don't set myself up for failure trying to duplicate Hank. Why not? Because Hank is never using Lord in a power two ball. I'm using power one ball in rookie every chance I get. <laughs> okay, Mr. Appleby. Appleby. <laughs> no, I, I pull out the big guns when the big guns are needed. But, but the, the big, big guns, guns are needed on par fours that are you, you can, can get, get within you know wedge range, so you can make the shot. Oh no 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 no! Please believe I'm gonna pull out some balls. Right. No, I'm saying on par threes. Now when I play pro, I use uh, power three balls on par threes. But in rookie, I'm always if I can use a marlin, I'm using a marlin. If I can use a Navigator or a Quasar. I'm saying rookie. It's a difference. Those those two pins are different. Those yeah, where you those two T boxes are different. Yes, sir. You're right. Five mile an hour wind. Thank you. Okay, let's go. Ooh, great ball. Way great left. Yuck. 10%, Hank. It don't matter. Oh, look at that. That's so terrible. Ah, you need this to be to the right. 
But how close is it? How close is it? Ah, slow down, slow down. Slow down. Oh! Mm, see, that's, that's the, the problem, problem sometimes. sometimes. I, get I get a little wanky when I try to curl the ball, and, and I can't, can't hit the perfect, perfect ball as often. Just, I mean, I mean that's, that's kind, kind of an excuse, but a little, little bit of reality, too. Hey, Mark, thanks for coming out, buddy. Yeah, give definitely. To to be quite honest, everybody's stream is behind. There's about a seven or eight second lag between Hank actually taking the shot and us actually seeing what he does. Our conversation happens. Uh, well, it doesn't happen before. It just sounds. It just seems like it does, you know, because the the video takes longer to happen than our conversation does. If that makes any sense whatsoever. And I got we an extra seven a seconds delay, vortex, so a, sir. I ha I got a seven second delay, so I'm gonna push it up to live. So I'll probably only be five seconds behind now. Yeah, Gib. Yeah. Did you hear how you... Well, see, you're watching it in real time with the stream. But us being on the phone, it's happening in... Ah, God, it's hard to explain. I don't know how else to explain it. If you, uh, if you and I, Gib, were on the phone talking while we were playing, there would be a lag between me watching your shot and you actually taking your shot. Same in return with me taking my shot and you actually seeing the shot happen. I guess because it's got to go through six billion... Uh, I don't know, whatever computer talk langu language I'm trying to use. Hank might be able to help me out better with that. Hey, Stewie! Logan, they couldn't pay me to watch Holy Moly. Exactly, Gib, exactly. Such a hard shot. Hey, Hank, yes, Robert sir. Michael Stewart is in the chat saying hello, sir. Thank you for that. Stewart! I'm just not a big fan of miniature golf. I mean, the commercial for Holy Moly, or not the, yeah, I guess the commercial or the advertising they do for Holy Moly looks halfway fun, but it wouldn't catch my attention to not to watch it. Like, I don't watch American Gladiator, things like that, so... I'm not going to tune in for Holy Moly myself. But what exactly I is Holy Moly? Is going to watch it. What exactly is Holy Moly? It's a brand new show that just came on. It's uh, Stephen Curry. He plays for the Golden State Warriors. He's the uh, like executive producer. He's uh, he helped create this show, and it's like a goofy miniature golf. But Michael Fox said it's a badass, and he says he loves it. Okay. Is it on a local? Is it on one of the the local stations? It's, it's NBC, local, Fox, or? it's on ABC, I think. 
ABC, okay. Extreme Miniature Golf Courses. Is it on now, guys? You know, somebody said that's some type of uh, psychological warfare when it comes to this game. If you want to upset your opponent, take the full 30 seconds every time they'll get tired of waiting, and it'll <laughs> aggravate them. Well, there are some times where I take the full 30 seconds, not on purpose, but it, it happens. Hey, Fenzel's in the chat. Yo, sir. Oh, no, excuse no, me, excuse me, that's tot. tot. Let's go. Excuse I me. I like them both. Let's go. It's called Holy Moly. It's called Holy Moly. You remind me of Kurt Russell, Hank. <laughs> I love Ingrid. Ingrid's the best. She's the best for sure. Thank you, Ingrid. I love Kurt Russell. He's one of my favorite actors. One of my most favorite actors. How's that? My father was an, an, an avid golfer, as you are, Hank. And, uh, all summer long, he would take us almost every weekend. We would go to one of the different three or four putt-putt golf courses in the area. He said it was a good way for him to practice his putting. He took his own putter and everything. Nice. Tater Todd, this is Troy. I'll actually type into you. I'll give you a couple of pounds here. That's me. And then uh, Jay Harvey's with us, too. Oh, Speak up, Jay. This way? What do you think? I've seen a lot of people go that way. It bounces real high, but with low winds like they are, it might be a a good uh, a good ace opportunity. Yes, sir. Tot 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 tot. The same we do every time, right? Is it really? Yeah. <laughs> this, hey, Todd, what's up, boss? This hole is this hole is a definite hanker rhythm hole. No matter what you do, you're gonna wind up in about the same spot every time. Pretty brutal. Pretty brutal. What's what's the lead? What is the lead? Is the question? Is it 25? Just walk no, it down. 24. You didn't go check, did you? I did, because I'm in fourth, so it's only, I mean, it comes right up. Yeah, but you're in fourth through 14. You got uh, you still got four holes left to play, so you should uh, you should have absolutely no issues making up those three strokes. Oh, this is where we made our great eagle. <laughs> oh, right. Or albatross, I mean. Sounds like one of those old Native American uh, Native American tales. This is the story of the Great Eagle. <laughs> so, so hold on. This account has never made it out of um, Rookie Weekly? I don't know. I don't pay huh. attention to stuff like that. Huh. Because I'm shocked that minus 24 is in the lead. Like I said, Jay, I don't pay attention to stuff. Right, but I'm saying, but it's a, you, right, but I'm saying it's one rookie account that you play. That when you play those other rookies, they like have a lot of gold medals like you. It's a tougher rookie account because it's moved up in the in the weekly league. So to see a minus twenty four when it was a, some drops that could be made in this course is kind of surprising. That's all I'm saying. Even though you're going to dominate the minus 24 with probably a minus 28 or something. It's just unfair that I just have a lot of rookie accounts and I get to hone in on the different adjustments. That's it. That's all it is. If I only had one account, I'd be shooting 24, 25, 21. I mean, it's just... 
No, no, no. I'm talking about your, your competition. Because, no like, way. and that's what I'm saying as well. Since they only probably have one account they're playing, they're just at a disadvantage. Right. But I'm saying the leagues, the league, the weekly leagues make a difference. Like, I got two pro accounts. So one of them has never made it past pro one. So, like, the person in first place in that in that bracket was minus 25. Now I have another pro account that's made it up to all the way to pro three. The person in first place in that bracket was at minus 27. Got so I'm you. saying, so that that's what I'm saying. So you you having all these goals on this account, I'm surprised that the person who's in first only has a minus 24. Because I'm 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 thinking that you would be playing against other people well, with more goal sure fat than an account though either. either. I mean, it only has 800 games. I only have five goals on it. Right, so maybe this account has never made it out of rookie, which is a beautiful thing if you ask me. Michael Fox, very intelligent. <laughs> Okay, okay, let's celebrate. Here, I haven't seen it yet, but let's celebrate. Here, Here, you definitely got this hole dialed in. How many albatross is that for you on this particular hole throughout your accounts? Five. Nice job, nice job. Definitely have a point with lining up on the left-hand side of that, that fairway so that you can go straight at the hole from that little area on the left hand side of the you know right beside that sand trap yeah the yep. flat spot if yeah. you will yeah and you, you know, know uh, unless you're in these streams, streams right and you're watching them and, them and you're listening to the adjustments you're never going to know that right <laughs> very true so gotta try to get on that left third of the fairway and use that Goliath approach up the hill because it's pretty much a straight shot if you just aim it to the left-hand side of the hole. And uh, as you can see, it just ran right up that hill. And uh, Hank, they're asking for a replay of that shot. Well, here we go. Let's go. That's a good idea. I was going to ask the same thing. Anybody who wants to know the best way to play this hole, this is it. He's, he's definitely got it dialed in. A little flat spot right there by that sand trap. How'd you how'd you say it went, Hank? No spin whatsoever, right? No, no side, no top, whatsoever. no bank. What, what you, you have, have to do is find it to line up directly at the left edge of that hole, right? Maybe just to the inside of the hole, and then it's about three or four squares short and uh, mid adjustment off of um, zero elevation. Let them know that it's a uh... And they were asking for it one more time so they oh, could see it one more time. Here we go. <laughs> yeah, yep, and it's it, with the Goliath, right. And the easiest and you said the easiest way to, to get that shot to happen is to wind up with your drive on the left hand side of the fairway back or, there, yeah, right? The, the left third of the fairway, right? Just don't do what I do every time you try to get to the left side and wind up in the trees because that's my biggest problem. Nice. That is definitely a nice shot. <sighs> so there we go. Three to go. Now, there you go. We went one, two, two. So that gets us to 29. Can we go 2, 2, 2? I mean, we asked for that the last time and we weren't able to do it, but let's try. Oh, this is the hole that is... So <laughs> now, don't jinx yourself. Don't think yourself out of it. Gib, I think so. You know, I th the, the hardest part of... I think the obviously the only difference in this hole 
to make it to the to the spot to where you need to be able to get your uh, Goliath shot is is from the drive, right? Just how far back the tee is. So, I mean, if you can get up to where he was with his drive, that shot is definitely probably workable with every division. Oh, I play that in expert as well. Absolutely. Okay. It give give posted the question. You know, I assume that works in every division. Yes. And yeah. I'm I'm basically assuming you know as long as you can get your drive far enough down there to where you're in Goliath range, mm -hmm. I can't imagine it wouldn't work in every division. I put 10% on this. I might, I might go 20, 20 here. I actually might. Just to see. You think you're that far off, or should you try for 15? Alright, we'll do 15. Love the basic balls. I love these guys. Give, they're saying, as long as you push forward to account for the fact that you went down into the bunker, you know, it's, I, you know, I, I don't know, man. Which, on, on, which, on which hole? I'm assuming he's still talking about the last hole for that shot. Oh, okay. He said he's just wondering if you have to adjust down into the bunker if it still works. Because that, that bunker, you know, for the, for that shot with the Goliath, that bunker beside you is deep, so. All right, everybody, cross your fingers. Sticking, sticking to my adjustments, adjustments. stick to the plan no matter what. Yeah. Stick to you the know, plan if, if no matter Huckleberry, what. If Huckleberry were here, he'd be typing that in or he'd be saying it. Oh, I know. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, I'd get you give. Yeah, it's definitely consistent for him. Spencer Spencer earlier, earlier, and, and he, he said, said, you know what, this, this is the reason why you're not supposed to try somebody else's shot. Because it, it doesn't work. work. Because it's, it's not, not your shot. shot. You're, you're not, not familiar, familiar with it. it. Just go right. take the, the shots, shots from other people, people as guys, guys right? right? As, as a starting point. point. And, and then, then you, you have to tweak it yourself to what, what fits you and your clubs. So... No better words spoken. All right, so, so since this is a shootout, I'm, I'm going to go from the left side this time instead of the right. right. Yeah, that's the way I've always played it from the left until this tournament. And now this you're this into tournament. Bunkers? Yes, set up right where where his is right now. That's yeah. that's normally where I set up. But I'm winding up, you know, about as consistent with each <laughs> shot as I do from a, from the left hand left hand side when I play tour ten. In in pro, you're playing okay. So when you play this hole in tour ten, what's your downhill adjustment? Is it twenty percent? Well, again, you're you're talking language I don't use. I generally add an extra ring to ring and a half. If that, you know, again, I I, I don't go by any of the. Uh, any of the app adjustment lingo, I, I, you know, everything's by feel. But I generally do add an extra ring to a ring and a half, depending on whether I've got 10 mile an hour wind or 15 mile an hour wind. Because tour 10, you know, you got crazy winds. 
Hey, what's up, Brian, Papa Sloth, Michael Griffin? How you guys doing? How dare you come into Pittsburgh country with the Seattle Seahawks logo in your icon? <laughs> Yeah, Gib, I'm with you. You know, I already have one of those brains that allows everything to distract me anyway. So I think if I were to have to look away from the game screen for long enough to put all the numbers into my to my app over here, that it would just add more distraction. So I think that's probably why I play the way I play. Would I benefit from having an app that that, you know, that would help me with some of these adjustments? Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. But I just think it would be more distracting than a help for me. Because I'm already ADD as it, you know, as they come. So. Yeah, yep, we, we tried, tried um, we, we tried, tried the, the uh, <laughs> Kingmaker here last time, and I said, no, we're not going to do Berserker. We're going to go Kingmaker. We made it with some this incredible shot from the rough. But and how about hitting it straight this time? It's straighter than you hit it last time. <laughs> I totally agree, my friend. I totally agree. I totally agree. Problem is, though, this goes into the bunker. So we need to go 20% Hank, line it up, pull it back 20%, do your adjustment for 20%, put that power on power five, pull it back, then push it back up. You don't have a straight tailwind, so respect that, that uh crosswind. He says, no, I'm doing what I do. Nice shot, Hank. Beautiful. Slow down. All right. Thank you. All right, Hank. I did exactly what you said, Jay. I I, I considered that 20%, made the adjustment for the wind, and then I pulled it all the way back and then put it back up to about 75% over power. So I was going to take about two bars of topspin off, but then I'm thinking what happens if that two bars – hits in the rough and just skids out. I don't want that to happen like that right there. So I just decided to underpower it versus complete overpower. If I complete overpower that, you you know that's in the bunker out there. So He's got a katana ball. All right, we're going to finish off with an albatross for the 30. Right? Let's go right now. Let's do it. That wouldn't be too spectacular now, would it? It's an accomplishment to get a minus 27, let alone a minus 30. Couple little mistakes here and there, though. You know what I mean? And there's a great chance you're probably going to approve for the weekend round come Saturday and Sunday. Let's hope, right? Thank you, Papa. Thank you, Logan. Mark, thank you, my friend. Absolutely. Drive nine to the left of the trees, Hank. I guarantee you like the angle. 
Don't do it, Hank. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I just can't do it just because I haven't played it that way before. Even I mean, you, it, you, you've dialed in that right side so much, you know what I mean? It, it would be hard for you to change and try to figure out how you're going to approach the cup over top of that sand trap. Because if you if you go to the left side of those trees, you're going to wind up having to compensate for that sand trap. Whereas if you stay to the right, you can go beside that sand trap and hit that little rough bump. But two, maybe three mile an hour winds, there's still a little piece of rough between the sand trap and the green over top of that sand trap. Be careful with that much top spin, boss. Oh wow. What what just happened? There is no way that that wind pushed me that far into the into the rough like that. That's baloney. Yeah, I don't know what happened there. I'm gonna replay that. I'm gonna watch that again because I have that set up everywhere all the time in the same exact spot. And I adjusted or what was that? 4.3 mile an hour wind? 3.3, 3. 3. yeah. Yours is 3.3. I adjusted it 1.7 rings. I actually adjusted 1.9 rings to be safe. That's probably where the problem came in. And it flew into the rough. There's no way. Gib says that he don't think he doesn't think that you adjusted. You know what? While you're playing, I can rewind it and look at it. Hank, you did not adjust. What actually happened was the whole screen moved under your uh, finger instead of you just your ball guide. Well, thank you. Sucks. Yeah, Mark's saying the same thing over in the chat. Do, do your Troy impersonation. Get the eagle the hard way. Oh, yeah. All right. We set it up. That doesn't look like that typical of a shot with a uh, probably a Goliath. We'll be fine. <clears throat> Maybe even uh, what do we got? Hornet? Well, I just, all I did was chip it out of that rough and put it right where I would normally land with my drive. Well, I could. And then I was behind that tree. Right, but no, what I'm saying, at, Hank's, what I Hank's did, got a better lie. He's got a better lie now. Okay. You hit it right down here, and then you hit it the exact same shot through the rough bump, and you made it. Correct. I yeah. saved Eagle with that rough bump. Yeah, Correct. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> I couldn't hit it down there because I was under that tree. That's that's all I'm saying. I don't think I have a good shot here. Not enough, enough backspin. Nope. I'm going to run out of time. I had to take it. Oh, go in! <laughs> no! 
That was close. So don't say perfect get, gets it. Oh, perfect probably gets it because you did hit it great to the right. Yeah. Wow, wow what, what an anticlimactic end to this, this stupid, stupid round. You're still in first place. That's still going to be a really good tiebreaker tie for your bracket. I wouldn't let it get to you too much. I know well, you wanted, I, a, be I, I I know you wanted a better score man. than that, but I know you were trying to come off that that minus seventeen. But like I said, the good thing is you're going to learn from the night and Saturday or Sunday, whatever day you choose to bring out that can of whoop, it's gonna it's gonna be effective. Uh, I don't, I don't even want to look, look at that anymore. anymore. I'm, I'm done. done. I'm out. And not to mention, a twenty eight under is is a pretty daggone good score, man. Well, I have to do another one, and I'm just going to keep going. So anybody who wants to stay, you can. If you want to leave, absolutely. Thank you for joining us right now. But I have to do another one just to get five of my eight in and uh, leave three for tomorrow. Well, I have let my beautiful little one stay up much later than normal, even on a summer night. So... I'm going to put her in the bed and let her lay down and get to read her a couple of books, no, but I will be back. Yeah, you can come back. Absolutely. It'd be great. And, uh, you come back. Jay will keep me company. And Jeff Lalonde, welcome to the chat. Nice. Thanks, everybody, for coming out, and uh, I'll talk to you when I get back. See you guys. All right, Troy. Papa Sloth said, I wouldn't want Hank in my rookie bracket. I feel the same way, Papa. Thank God he's never in my... I had Helios in my pro bracket today, though. And I'm uh, one ahead of him. <laughs> oh, you had to get that in, didn't you? <laughs> I love it. Congrats, man. That's, that's, that's some good playing. Well done. So, Hank, yep. you have this uh, chart up on the left side of your screen. If you're not going to use it, just take it down. Are, are you? Are, are, you're, you got the you got the notebook app on the side of your screen. Are you using it? Yes or no? Yes. Because I didn't. I haven't seen none of your calculations come up on it as of late. Sorry. Point something in now just to see if it's working or whatever. Okay. Yep. There's 78, 80, 90, that's good. Uh, blah, 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 blah. That, this is, oh, this account is just going to destroy this course. We're in first already. Let's go. Let's stay there. <laughs> they don't even have 100 people in it. They'll have 100 by tomorrow. Oh, yeah. The, by the time I'm done, they'll have 100 people in here. Oh, I, I gotta make sure I have a uh, katana ball in. All right, plus twenty, win two ball. Oh, I gotta switch accounts. What what account is it? Account what? No, account two. This is the hit and chase account. We're going to go hit and chase it. Didn't even take notes on this account. 
the first time through. I don't even know what we 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 um, ended up with. Let's start off with an ace. Come on, Shabe. Thank you, brother. Welcome, welcome, welcome. All right, what do we do here? Two back, one quarter left. They just start running in together once in a while. Three short. A little bit outside, right about there. 2.3 on max is 2.4. Perfect ball. Boom! Bam! Bam! That's a it's the start we're looking for. Exactly. All right, let's go. All right, same thing. Hole number two. Come on, Mark. Let's go shave. That's right. Thank you, Jeff. Three, two, one, hole in one. Mr. Smith, that's a boy. Well done, sir. I love it. It's still a little quiet to use. Oh, quiet. All right, still quiet. All right, let me watch him. I'll see if I can increase my mic volume. How's that? Is that better? A little echoey probably, but um, I've moved it up. Hopefully that'll be okay. All right, all right, all right. All right, perfect shot. It's kind of like a power curl, you know what I mean? When all you have to do is set it up in the middle and then pull it straight back, pull it over to the right and power curl to the right and it goes in the middle every single time, right? That's that adjustment on this tee shot. Don't even have to think about it. But the next shot is what is critical. One and a half back, one half right. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go one. I'm going to go one right this time and aim in the same spot, which is one. Ooh, close. One ball to the right of the stick and see if we can't get it to... Such a short spin, though, from down here. That's the problem. One and a half, one. Point one adjustment. Perfect ball. My gosh. He says it's well played and I just think that's a terrible shot. Oh. oh, that green is so tricky. It's impressive to me a little bit. I mean, but your expectations are much different, and that's respectful. Mm. 
Yeah, we're gonna have to keep tweaking it. Tweaking it the next time around, see if we can't make it, and uh, then take it to the weekend. I've only made it once so far in all these accounts, and it's super frustrating. And once I made it, I'm like, okay, that's right in the center. I'm good now, and haven't made it yet after that. Oh, Michael Moss! Come on, Mossy! No, Michael, no! <laughs> there it is. There it is, Papa. I did the, uh, I ranked 29th in the pro category of the Easter tournament. Then I relegated every time after that because I have so many accounts. Just can't keep them all up at the same level all the time, right? So, this is difficult. All right, my man, my man. See if this works. This will be interesting. This is just a uh, complete guess. You better play twenty percent downhill. I didn't put anything on it. Hmm. Yep. Yep. That works in expert back there. But it doesn't work in rookie. <clears throat> All right, what's hole number three? Par five. Par five, five, the one where you try to get the sand bump or rough bump. Haven't haven't made it in a week. Feels like. Got to got to bounce from one fairway to another fairway. Then you set yourself up for the sand or rough bump. The eagle, the albatross. <clears throat> okay, baby, we get to go first. Yes, mama. Oh, wouldn't that be fun to do, huh? What's going on? Look at that. Look at how that does that. There's a big glitch in this game. Hank doesn't talk like that, does he? Hank, where's your left spin at? No left spin. Okay. He puts right spin on it. I want to keep it down the right-hand side if I can. Nope. All right, that's good. That gives me a Viper shot in there probably at mid-distance. So that's okay. Yeah. Wasn't a fan of that, of that spin. I know. But this is your game. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Did you see how far back that hit, though? That was a, a full three, four yards like that guy just hit way back. So if I would have moved that further up into the um, into the rough, the uh, yellow bullseye, I would have made that easily. But His didn't clip, though. Yours clipped. Right, right, right. Min, max, min, max. So it's... Just a little bit outside max.
Hmm. Getting closer, closer, Jay. Little by little. All right, you got to get a drop on four. Oh, yeah. We'll be all right. I think, I think we can get, get that. that. We'll, we'll put Berserker, Berserker in again. You know, you know what I'd love to do is be able to hit that Berserker all the way down there in between those two bunkers just short of the green. You know what I mean? Yeah. That, if you can pull off a shot like that, that'd be impressive. And be careful with how much right curl you use this time. Why? Well, what did I do last time? No, well, I hit it. I hit it to the left. I hit it great left. That's the reason why I went out into that um, into that rough. I actually probably don't even need a berserker, to be honest with you. But it is what it is. They're just collecting dust in my. My, my chest. William says it's plus 20%. This is getting annoying. Hole one, I'm adjusting like 30% and it's still not enough. Well, William, what, um, what, what are you using? What, what club are you using? What's your adjustment? And let's, let's talk, talk through it. it. I, I just made like, like three hole in ones in a row on the hole number one. I'm gonna go with, I usually only go 10% on this one. I'm gonna go 20% and just make the same adjustment and see if that helps. Big huge curl, great right. And that's going to be short. Right down. We, we haven't broke the 30 mark yet, have we, tonight or today? 25, 25, 29, 28, because I screwed a bunch of stuff up. Boy, that's terrible. All right, quarter top, quarter left. There. Are you telling me you're gonna play twenty percent with on a whole number four? Two point five. No, no on, on this, this one, one right here. here. Okay. Because it's a shootout. shootout. I'm, I'm just trying. trying. You know what I mean? Right. Because they usually only play ten percent. That's still to the right. Man, just cannot get that over far enough. You know what I mean? Just can't do it. Crazy. I don't get it. My friends, something to do with an audio cabin. What's that? Fine, let me do this. Let me go to control panels. Sound. Go to my manage audio devices. Go to the sounds. Microphone. Hello, hello, hello. Yes, yeah, it's, it's on so low. How do you increase that volume? Go to properties. Listen. Levels. Levels. It's only at 41. So if I move it up, see now we're moving way up to 87, 90. Now we're getting an echo. Hit OK. It's still there. All right. How can I configure? P 
computer dictates to his computer, he prefers it to be typing, and particularly prefers it to pen and paper. Okay. Whatever that is. Have to adjust the volume of a microphone, blue snowball. All right, I've done that. You can proceed to the next step. Okay, there you go. Finish. Levels. Okay. okay. All right, I, I get, get out, out of that. that. Out of that, out of that. Did, did it stay, stay there? Yeah, yeah, it did. All right, so now what I can do is reduce the volume of the microphone down to this, and hopefully you can hear me much better now. Let's hopefully that's better. That wasn't, that wasn't very good, good grammar, grammar there. there. Let's hopefully, hopefully that's, that's better. better. <laughs> All right, All right, hole, hole number, number four. four. Um, Let's do it, Jay. Berserker it is. You should forfeit some of these holes so this, this doesn't get promoted. We have 120 Berserker balls to use, buddy. You want to buy some? <laughs> Too bad you can't gift them to me. Yeah, well, well we're, we're not in what? what? In the, the Asian, Asian market, market where, where they, they have, have uh, 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 ball gifting apps over there? there? Must be nice indeed. I'm only going to put three and a half, three and a quarter tops in on it. Oh, I did, did it again, again Jay. Jay. Are, Are you kidding, kidding me? Oh, oh my gosh. gosh. That, that is terrible. terrible. It's, it's going to go way out to the right, right again. again. Well, well, this time, time I didn't, didn't put enough. enough. I, didn't I didn't put all, all the tossing on, on so it's going to stay in the fairway. fairway so. So. But, but man, is that terrible. Wow. Brutal. Now you got to play with a bunker in your way. No, no that, that, I mean, my, uh, my, my horn will get over there very easily, and, and it might even be a wedge. wedge. I, don't I don't know. I don't, I don't think it's going to be a wedge. I think I'm too far from the wedge. wedge. I think it's, it's going to be like, like a real min hornet. Oh, you're going to be in hornet range. Why did you give up on the thorn? I, I never liked, liked the thorn, thorn ever, at the be even at the beginning of this game. game. There, there are certain... Um, there, there are certain courses where, where the thorn, thorn is great, great and then there, there are certain courses where the, the hornet is necessary. And, and this, in my opinion, opinion is, is a hornet, hornet course. course. My, my opinion. Max, min, so we're going to go medium here. And that's 3.4. Close. What was your adjustment? You went medium or min? Medium. That medium. was closer to min, probably. Uh, no, because that was 3.4 versus 2.2. .2. I don't think either of them would have went in. You know what I mean? Or you could have went halfway between min and medium. It was nowhere close to max. No, it wasn't. No, you're right. Nowhere close. I guess I needed to use that slider bar, I guess, a little bit, right? Yeah, but you can think fast on your feet, though. Great shot. Yeah, I probably would have did 2.8. Hmm. Not 2.8. You mean, like, actually, like 2.0, actually. Because I pulled it too far back, and it... Miss to the right, if that makes sense. You needed to do less. I needed to do less than 3.4. I needed to do like 2.8. Is that what you said? I just said 2.8. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. My fault. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
That's, That's a miss. miss. You gave a stroke back. Yep, 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 yep. Boom. Okay, William, this is the uh, this is the shot we were talking about, buddy. Here we go. Plus 20%. I mean, Dave's going to go first. And if he hits it in the bunker or if he just... He might even just forfeit right away. No, he's going to play it. Okay, good. So, William, on this one, I play the um, Goliath 5, 6, and 7, right? They're all the same to me. So what I do is I go two backspin, one quarter left... Left... Um, I shoot two backspin, one quarter left bar, okay? Then I go 20% on the wind app, as you can see. And then I go max adjustment for the wind. So, here we go. Oh, and I got the, the that's okay. Berserker's fine. We'll still be okay. Two back, quarter left. Bring it back three or four squares. Put it right there, just outside that that cut line between the light and the dark square. 3.6 on max is 2.7 rings. 1, 2.7. Perfect ball. All right, just pretty close. All right, good luck, sir. Those shots right there, they hurt the most when uh, when they come up that close and you hit them great. You're like, oh, my God. <laughs> right? When, when you know you shouldn't be hitting them great at all, ever. All right, seven, six, five. That's four. Here's five. Okay, this is the par three again that we really have no adjustment for whatsoever. So what we're going to do is just try to get it close and move on. With the katana ball. Did anybody play a, a percentage on this? Did Jay, did you say like 20% or something crazy like that? Yeah, that definitely in pro. It, this is a tough... I've got the birdie every time in pro, nowhere close to uh, hole-in-one, but this... Because I, I, I need to learn how to play right there in pro between the two bunkers. I'm playing on the left side, and you have to adjust it down in the bunker... Gets my, it makes my nerves bad. I, I've been uh, using a wedge a lot, a lot because it's been coming up on the the fringe. Oh, look, look at this garbage. garbage! We're just so in trouble right here. <laughs> oh, just stay up on the green. All right, we, we can chip that in. All right, that's, that's what, what happens, happens when you um, when, when you try something you're not familiar with, with right? Oh, okay, thank God it's staying right there. Yeah. Yeah. Like, like I, I said, said, I have so many rookie, rookie accounts. It, you know what? I just, I just try stuff on certain, certain holes. When I know I have no chance at a hole-in-one because I don't know the adjustments, you have to start trying stuff, right? You can't keep doing the same thing that doesn't work over and over and over again. So... That's why I tried that a little bit, a different shot there. And it obviously, excuse me, did not work at all. Which is fine. It's fine if we make birdie. It's not fine if we don't. Oh. Yikes, says the man. Oh, 
point four is the adjustment on this short minimum adjustment. I don't even adjust less than six miles per hour in rookie. I don't adjust. Not not when it's this close. Yeah. Well, I, I like, like hitting, hitting the stick right in the, in the center, center so it goes in. in. But, but you're right. right. You, you really, really don't, don't even need to adjust. You can even eyeball it. You know what I mean? With that short of an adjustment, just kind of move it over just a, a hair to the right, and you'd be fine. But we've talked about this on a regular basis. I like to just practice my um, my adjustments for habit. Right, each right. And every time, so I don't get out of the routine. Right, so. You can get really out of the routine really quickly here if you don't. Um, oh, he made that. Are you kidding me? No, we have it for him. Gosh darn it. Good, good shot. shot. Go to the shootout. Go left side and put your white ring just on edge of bunker. Four backspin, four, five right spin. Okay. Mama balls. Mama balls. All right. Four back, five right. Four back. That is put your white ring just on edge of bunker. Put that down in the note. All right. What do we got? The hammerhead here. White ball. Perfect shot. Seven yards away. 5.9. All right. Here we go. Plus 20. We have the katana now, so we have the right ball on. Two and a quarter. Three back. Spin there. Two point eight adjustment. That's nah, only two point five, so. Put a little, little bit of spin, spin on it to the right. Try to keep it from staying out there. And it will go, go in the hole if you hit it. Hmm. Oh, come on. That's, That's a, a winner. winner. It's okay. okay. Hole number six. Kingmaker, let's go. Good, Good luck, Mikey. Mikey. Good, Good luck, luck, sir. sir. 2.2 2 is the adjustment for the wind. too far, far to the, the middle, middle of the, the, the fairway, fairway there. there. Not, Not what, what we want. want. Want that to the left of the, the third fairway. fairway. Ah, that's, that's more to the right, right side of the middle of the fairway. fairway. That's, that's not, not good. good. Ooh, we're going to make it just that much more difficult to try to run it in there. there. 
Michael Moss. Come on, Moss. Get the no, save, Moss. Damn it. Get the save. Shouldn't be going after the dunk, Moss. Man, you, you got to go after the dunk. If that's if that's what you're comfortable with, but you just gotta know, just gotta know that adjustment, and you gotta hit it, you gotta hit it perfect. Looks, Looks like, like we still, still might have, have this angle here, Jay. Hank, they need your Facebook name. Okay, okay man. Hold on. Is it Hank Morris? Uh, Hank, Hank in Ohio. Ohio. Just, just say, say Hank, Hank Morris, Morris Ohio. Ohio. Hank Morris o Ohio for the Facebook name. Minute adjustment is one point eight. Oh, oh he hit it great. great. Hang, Hang on, on to, to it. it. Uh, Perfect ball, Dave, it's in. Oh, oh, oh. Good night, Ingrid. Okay, Moss. Okay, Moss. Hey, Ingrid, thank, thank you, you so much. Thank, thank you, you, thank you, thank you for being here. Um, look forward to seeing you next time. Hopefully um, this time was entertaining. Hopefully next time will even be more entertainment for you when we go 33, 34 or under. So see you next time. Nice, Mr. Smith. You're playing from the pro tees. Very nice. Mossy tipping it in for birdie. Bam. Man, that's, that's like making, making a birdie on that hole. You know that? Making, oh, which, making an eagle here is like making a birdie. Oh, you're so used to the albatross. Okay. Terrible. Terrible. Oh, bam. He's going to make it with a razor two straight, straight up, up the hill. hill. Watch, Watch this. this. All you do is hit perfect. Oh, hit it great. It's good playing with you. Good luck, sir. Good luck. Man, there's nothing good on that card at all. All right, Hank, seven and eight, seven and eight, seven and eight. We need. We haven't had seven yet. We're close. I mean, we made it one time in the shootout, but we really haven't been. Uh, Ultimately close on this. Which is frustrating. Right, here's what we're going to do. We're going to do the quarter top. We're going to go one left. Bounce it right there. One point four is the adjustment on the rings. And a little bit of curl to the left. J J J J J there it is Sweet Watch this toilet bowl Ooh. 
We'll take it. We'll we take it. We will take it. So it's the same adjustment, one full left, quarter top, right on that line between where the dark green and the light green are segmented, right, where they're split, and then with a little curl to the left. Oh, you put curl on it also? Just a teeny bit. I mean, you can probably even see me if you, if you were watching for it, you could see it. But if I didn't mention it, you'd be like, wow, how do you make that? Okay, there's seven. Now, you got to get right on eight. Don't be scared to use the 20%. Adjust the wind. But, I mean, I guess you want you know what you want to do. All right, Mama. I got Mama now on Facebook. Bam. All right. Um, I'm giving my caddy coaching here. I didn't hear what you said, pal. I said, don't be scared to use the 20% for the wind adjustment if you don't get a straight tailwind. But I said, you have a good idea of what you want to do. And then if you make sure at the top you put in the right power ball. You got power three up there now. So if you change it, make sure you change that also. All right, we're locked and loaded. We are locked and loaded. All right, full top, one left, and just um, about 75% overpower. And we know the wind angle is coming from south east to northwest look at that angle that's really pushing wow all right logan let me uh oh you definitely got to adjust for your wind and then push it back up. All right, Logan, I just accepted your request, sir. All right, 3.7 is a 2.7 adjustment for the wind push. So we want full and one. You're keeping your messenger on? You're not going to turn that notification off? No, nope, we're good. Um, 2.7, so that's almost three. Holy smokes. You got 3.7. But it's only 2.7 with the app, you know what I mean? Oh, because you got that. Okay, you got that wind arrow, I guess. Like I said, it's not coming up on the screen. Uh, this could, could be, be trouble. trouble. This, this could be trouble. trouble. Look, Look how far that went. Holy smokes. Wow. <laughs> beautiful, beautiful. <laughs> That's insane. That's so funny. I would much rather be shorter than that like the last time we drove it right between the bunkers. Perfect. Now you make sure you put a mid adjustment. Me measure out your uh, firefly. See, yeah. see where it's at. Max, mid. It's definitely probably going to be mid. But measure it out. You want to use the use the adjust. Use your uh, use some numbers this time. So, so it's, it's max right, right there. The so, so it's, it's going to be. We're just, just going to go at just, just below, below max. max. Use some top spin. No, I don't need to do top spin. I promise you that. So we'll, we'll do 1.5, okay? okay? Perfect ball.
Okay, there you go. So you're still still on for minus 15. This is beautiful. This is beautiful. Minus 15 on the front. This is beautiful. Now, don't forget to adjust on hold nine this time. Make sure that the actual the screen doesn't move, but the the ball guideline moves. Yeah, yeah, I, I, yeah, yeah we. we uh, that, that was, was a really unfortunate, unfortunate mistake, mistake, right? Last, last time. time. Unfortunate. Huck, Huck sending me messages. messages. And he's, he's not, not even in the stream. stream. What's, What's up with that? that? You know what I mean? Maybe he's got his hands full. I don't know. Huckleberry. Um, let's, let's see here. So, so we, we can, can get, get to 16, 16 huh? Potentially. potentially. All right. So Huck, Huck hit a hole in one with the uh, with a guardian on hole on the hard part. So, so hole five. five. Right. Well, he got it super duper close with the guardian with the max backspin. He, he, he hit it, in or, or it's just, just super, super close? close. It's it's right next to the. Oh, to the very hole. nice. Well, well done, done, sir. Well, well done. done. Well done, my friends. Is, is he, he playing, playing now, or, or is, is that just a a, uh, a, a shot, shot um, visual that he sent? He just sent it. He's playing. It's from a rookie account. All right, very nice. Good, Good for, for him. him. That's, That's why, why he's not in the chat with us. Oh, I get to play Mikey again. All right, buddy. We played, played him on a par five last time, and we're going to play him on a par five again. again. All right, make sure there's no bad adjustments this time, brother. All right, full top. This happens to me all the time. Full top, and I'm going all the way over there. Now I'm going to move it over here, though, when I do that. Same exact what? Number too. Why are you using that side spin to the right? That's because. unnecessary. You don't need that side spin to the right. If if so, you only need one bar. I do, I do that, that because, because I'm trying, trying to get, get a better angle coming, coming in. in. You, you know, know what I mean? mean? Uh huh. Trying, trying to get, get it, but it, it, you, you see, see how it funnels, funnels back, back to the, the left, left anyway. anyway? But, hey, hey as, 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 if, if I, I can, can get, get an extra foot, foot to, to the right, right I, I believe that's, that's going to help me. All right, so, so with, with that, that two, two and a half backspin, back right, right edge of the hole, it, it says mid adjustment, but we're, we're going to measure. Look at this, this guy. guy. Basic, Basic ball again, and, and six, six mile an hour win, the poor guy. guy. But, but he is, is a champ. champ. Made a perfect shot. shot. For, For that, that, he gets, gets well, well played. played. Just trying to show, show me up. up. All, right, All right, Max is right, right there. Min is right here. So we'll go more, more towards, towards Max. And we'll, we'll go two Max in. in. And we're, we're going to go a half left. left. What level's your sniper? I wish you would have used the sniper instead of Viper. Six. Yeah, as far as you hit it, you probably could have got there with a sniper. Three, five, and 2.3. Oh, 2.3. Shit. Not 1.0. Oh, I'm going to run out of time. Oh, I, oh, I got, got it off with, with the perfect, perfect too. too. Holy smokes. That Viper's not in Max, is it? Why'd you do a Max adjustment? Because it, it was, was in max. max. That Viper was in Max? Yep. yep. It, was, it, was, it was significantly closer, closer to Max than, than it was anywhere near, near mid.
I just, I just don't, don't have, have this dialed, dialed in, in that's, that's all. It's all there is to it. it. All right, right, Jay, we, we just, just need, need to back, back this up with another 15, 15 or 16 on the back side, side that's, that's all. That's 16, because you're going to you're gonna do right this time on hole four. What, what did we screw, screw up, up on four? four? Because you're using that berserker, and you're not getting it to the, you're not getting it to the right far enough. Mm -hmm. And we, we didn't, didn't make a hole-in-one on one either, either. So, so we, we lost, lost one there did. as well. You started off with a hole-in-one on one. Oh, oh, we, we did? did? You did get the hole in one oh, over. Oh, that's, that's no, no good. good. Great shot. All right. Mike Addison, Huckleberry with a minus 26, baby. Bam. <laughs> okay, Mike. Where, Where were those, those two, two drops? Because drop? Mike's, Mike, he's, Mike's in like expert weekly. So where's that sitting at, Mike? Dale was saying he thought minus 30. I said, Dale, if somebody gets a minus 28, it's going to go a long way. He's like, I think it's going to be a minus 30 par. I'm like, nah, not at all. You, you think, think it's, it's going to be, be less, less than 30? 30? So 30 is going to gonna win in a, in a 30. Whoever puts up 30s, they're, they're bringing home goals. It's going to be some brackets. It's going to be some brackets in pro, and it's going to be some brackets in rookie that win at minus 28. Watch what I tell you. Wow. Okay. okay. I, believe I believe you. But I'm saying it's going to be some other brackets where minus 28 is not going to get it done. Right, right, right. Well, let's put it this way. Minus 28, minus 30... Let's say max 30 in the opener is going to be the score to beat. But when you go to weekend and everyone has their numbers dialed in again, I'm thinking 31, 32. We'll see. We'll see. Mike is making it to the weekend round in pro this time. Huckleberry. Hey, hey, hey. That a boy, Michael. Way to come back from the, uh, the treachery of a week's off of not making the weekend and having to sit there and watch us play and you sit out and just say this is bs i can't stand it i need a break and then he comes back and just puts up what he needed to put up that's awesome right like mama bulls he says he's in first place with minus 24 and rookie like i said it this 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 course man because i'm sure it's people that are trying to get whole five and they're walking away with pars, hole six. They're walking away with birdies instead of eagles. I mean, so when you walk away with a par on a par three, and you walk away with a birdie on a on a par five, you're giving away strokes. And like us, and then on some of these uh, par fours, you, you got to try to get some eagles. But if you if you get the birdie, you're not doing bad. It's in there again. It's in there again. It's in there again. <laughs> yeah. This is about to be a special back night. Now, Hank, you got to come through on four. Oh, you bam. You got to come through on four. You got to come through on four. So, uh, ah, let's did I, see. What, did uh, I pick the right start, time to return? Let's start off with hole two. Okay, Troy, I'm glad you're here. I'm going to fall back a little bit. I might join. I'm definitely going to keep the TV screen on, but I'm going to make a phone call. Troy, you came at the – give my man the boost he needs. He's about to put together a special back nine. You see he got hot. You looks, see like he got hot. Done, looks like he he's done Looks like he's done pretty good on, on the seven. front nine too. <laughs> he, he got hot starting on seven. He's, he's, got the, he's got the eagle train going. This is what I call an eagle train. 
One, two, three, four, five in a row. He's got the yeah, Eagles going. See let's, that. let's go. Dale's on the stream now. Dale's streaming. Okay, maybe I'll return in a little bit. Hank, I'll be watching every shot, buddy. Okay, Love you guys. Thank, Thank you, man. Love you, man. All right. Keep it going, brother. Looks good. Looks good. Hello, everyone in the chat. Sorry I had to uh, vacate for a little while. I'm lucky to have my little baby girl with me again this weekend, so I was doing the data thing. I see you in the chat there, Mike Addison. Huckleberry! Hey, Boo Boo! Wanna go steal a pick and a basket? What's wrong, Hank? Get quiet. I just convinced myself to stick to the plan. I was going to do something different, and I'm just teasing myself, and I'm not going to do it. Well, I'm going to be the voice of Huckleberry. Stick to the plan. Stick to the plan. Do not deviate. Even though you haven't made this to shot on hold plan. two in a while, don't go and do something stupid. Exactly. And Mama Bulls, you're exactly right. I'm not sorry. I love my baby girl more than my life. I'm a 48-year-old data of a 7-year-old angel. Angel! That's right. I'm so excited. Just hide it. That was, was funny, funny when I played, played the Pointer Sisters, Sisters earlier today. Was it was funny. It was funny. <laughs> what was it? And who said it? It said, uh, I think that's about a different type of hole in one. Who yeah, was that? KD, who else? <laughs> yeah, KD, right? Come on, <laughs> Addison, that didn't suck. It's the best. 54 holes is awesome. Come on, man. I did. This is my one, two, three, four, fifth account today. Come on. So what's 18 times 5? 90, 90 holes. Let's go. Complaining about 54. Whatever. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Mikey, I love you. Sign do, sir. I'm going to put it way the hell out here this time. And you know it's not coming back when I do that. 2.1. 2.1 is the number to win with. <laughs> Michael Bossy giving a whole Huckleberry a hard time. He says only 54? A slacker. Oh, I hit it great. You skink. I've been called worse. Terrible. Just horrible. Well, look at the bright side. At least it did not go to the left of the cup this time. That is correct. <laughs> that is a good sign. We have corrected the lefts. And the only way we had to do it was hit it great right. I think, I think that's, that's about, about my only third great ball of the night out of all these holes. That's, that's not true. true. Maybe five. And you did better than he did. Hey, Shay was in the chat. I just scrolled up and I saw Shay was in yeah, the chat. Is he still here? here? Yeah. Yes, yes, Are yes. you with us, Mr. Shabe? Eight grandkids, Bulls. Wow. Come on, Carly. Get on his ass. Get him get those counts done. Great shot. 
Hank, when are you going to do your expert round? Tomorrow, Tomorrow night. night. Tomorrow night? Yeah. Yep. Why? Because I still have to do my expert. I still have to do my expert. I'm just curious when you were going to do yours. I don't know if I'm going to play it tonight or wait till tomorrow or what. Well, all I know is he is going to be very close and he's going to be so pissed that I'm going to knock this in the hole. I wish I, wish I had, had like an emoji that says, uh, not, not good enough, sir. Right? Not good enough. I bet they do, Mama. I bet they do. Dude, Dude there's something, something wrong with this, this stupid game out tonight. Two point two. Yeah, good luck on that. Oh, you suck. All right, let's see if that adjustment is even close. Oh, look at that. Well, I'll tell you what was close. Your time. Yeah, I beat, I beat him. him. Watch, Watch this. This is a nice shot. <laughs> wow, by point oh two. <laughs> Look at him wow, wow and I'll laugh, laugh and I'll laugh. laugh. That's, That's funny. funny. Good, Good luck. luck. That's, That's funny. funny. I told I him he was gonna, gonna lose right out of the gate. You did. So, so there is absolutely nothing to complain, complain about, sir. You were going, going to lose. lose. Le who, the her. I screwed this hole up the last time we played it, says Jason, or Jay. So we will not screw it up this time. He wanted me to put left spin. I said absolutely not putting right spin. And I hit it in the rough, and then it squirted out, and then I missed my rough bump um, viper. So... I'd love, love to just bang, bang it down there, hit it down there like that. But you don't know how it's going to jump out of the fairway. Three point two, which is one point eight. A perfect ball. Nice down the right hand side. My goodness, that is so far down there. That's going to be maybe like min distance Goliath. That's a good thing, right? Oh, no, uh, there, there might, might not be enough, enough room to uh, adjust, adjust back. back. You know what I mean? That's the problem. I'm not, not sure.
You know, you know why it's supposed, supposed to be 0. 0.9 and, and I went 1.2? Like... Yeah, because you went max distance and you said you were going mid, right? Or did you go mid distance and you oh, said no, you I were went, going I mid? I went max instead of going between max and mid, mid if that makes sense. It does. So, I pulled it two tenths too far and you saw I missed it to the right-hand side by probably two tenths or so. And I only understand remotely what you're talking about just by listening to you talk about it all the time. I tell you that you listening to you say what you're doing out loud truly helps me with my adjustments. You know, because as we've talked numerous times, I don't I don't use apps and I don't write any notes down. I just kind of, you know, I hate to use the words wing it, but that's what I do. I go by feeling. I wing it, and. Uh, you know, listening to you say, all right, my Goliath at max distance is 2.1 per ring. I'm like, all right, cool, that's on lock now. Now I know that my max, you know, my full-out Goliath is 2.1 per ring. Right, right. And so on and so forth. Ha! Ah, man, I gave another one up there. Shoot! I can't hit that to save me, bum. Man, that's too bad. All right, so what I have to do is get out of the app, force close it again. Why, they got a little lag going on? No, no, not lag, just a glitch. You know what I mean? It, you know, once in a while it won't let me adjust the, the ball as I want to quick enough. You know what I mean? And I don't like that. All right, hole number four. I don't want that. I want the Zerker. All right. Jay Harv is saying play to the right, whatever that means. Yeah, he, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, sir. All right, this is what I want to do. I want to look at the distances here. They're both 86 yards, so there's no reason not to use the higher accuracy club of the Hornet. All right. Jay says, I am not allowed to not get the drop here because I missed it on the front side. <clears throat> Ooh, look at that wind. Look at that wind. That just barreling it down to the the fairway, huh? Yep. I don't even need to use a king I mean a berserker here, to be honest with you. Perfect shot. But I have a hundred and twenty of them. One hundred and twenty of them. Hey, Emily's back in the chat. He starts out. Yeah, Emily. A whole lot of people are talking about that. My buddy, my buddy was saying the same thing about his uh, attempt at a qualifying round last night. And I say attempt because he didn't make it. Poor guy. But Ooh, I hit perfect for a change with a huge amount of curl on it and down the left-hand side. Stay out of that rough. All right, that's a pretty good shot there. Not a bad shot at all. So what did Emily say here? Sorry. Said that her tablet or her iPad was oh, frozen freezing on her. Oh, yeah. free Well, I, I don't know if she plays on it iPad. I think she plays on phones, but 
So he crashed a bunch of times and froze. That's terrible. Too bad. Where we go? 25, 25, 29, 28. And whatever we do here. Gosh. Can't break it that 30 mark yet. Uh, uh. Alright, look at that. There's max right there. So I'm at max right now. So that's good news for us. So we need to go one top and one to the left. You're going to put top spin on that with it being right there at the hole like that? I have to, yep. Look, Even though it's low level and, and the ball guide doesn't uh, show as far as it will actually go? 2.6 at max is 1.2. Remember, it's a it's a power five ball, so it should roll right up there. You know what I mean? I do. Perfect ball. Let's see what happens. Nice. Very nice shot, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Let's get some booms in the shot. <laughs> Sorry. That's bam, 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 bam. That's so funny. All right. That's the extent of uh, <laughs> what I know. Yeah, that's the extent of booms. Boom shakalakas. Boom. All right, J-Harb. J-Harb gave some bombs in the chat. That a boy? Excuse me. That in the boy? chat. Yeah, let's go. All right, we picked one up on the, on the back that we didn't have on the front, so... But Thanks, we did Stewie. pick up the seven, hole seven, that is going to be tough, right? Yeah. So let's see if we somehow can't pick up five. Huh. He says four back, five right, with a white cutting the bunker on the left. So who knows, right? So I'm just going to not stick All with right. the bunker. Now we got lots of booms in the chat. Thank you, thank you, thank you all. Thank you, Jason and Mike and Troy and Michael Hamas. Thank you all. Yeah, let's go. Yeah, Emily, that's right. iPhones. I killed it. It's murder. Son of a hack. Look at All this right. wind. That's crazy. Well, he is using the uh, Marlin ball. Of course, it's got one wind resistance. I tried the same shot, dude, and it doesn't work. I, 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 I did try this same shot myself a few times. I never got any closer than 2.6, 2.7. He got it to work, but it, it goes too far with that type of topspin to get it over that that rise. Right. So that's the problem with that angle of attack. And I think, I'm, well, I don't think, I know. When I lined it up, I was always much closer to the bottom of that sand trap, which is kind of on a downslope, which will throw you further or forward faster so that you hit the face of that next upslope before the uh, before One, the green. Six, four and five, there's no way. All right, we'll just do this. And we'll try it. What the hell? Get a little closer to the sand. I can't. 3.0, oh. and that's 1.9. Ah, oh, great ball. You stink. That's fine. That's fine. Nice, nice straight putt. putt. Yeah, still a makeable putt. Yep. Didn't even want to come near that sand. You know what I mean? Didn't want to flirt with it. I mean, I could have come way over there easily, but I just didn't. Let's play safe, get it done. 
Gotta and the only reason I, I said get closer, the only reason I said get closer to the Sam is, is you know, like I told you before, I, I played this hole in Tour Ten quite often. It was uh, the most hated, obviously go-to hole for play Demic. Oh, but, Ashley! Uh, oh my, oh my gosh. gosh, so close! An expert. She had the ring around the cup shot. The old toilet bowl. Yep. My toilet bowl tonight went all went in, which is great. You know, Ashley, did you did you play between the two sand traps? Yeah. It was sad. Very sad. Sixteen twenty-five. Five hundred and fifty-three games. I don't really want to see how many games I have on this account. I get a guy to rookie in this thing. We, we got to go to pro with this. Uh, behind the bunker. Okay, yeah. We are no longer playing rookie with this account. Okay. The grind goes well, KD. The grind goes well, sir. Look, look at my, my whole, my, it's, it's kind of like, it won't respond to me tapping the screen, which is really weird. And your, and your iPad's new, right? Or somewhat new? Well, it's the game. It's not the iPad. That's for sure. It's a glitch in the game. My opinion, humble. 2.6. Uh, Let's go. 2.6. I'm in agreement. I am in agreement. Two point six ish. And perfect. perfect I didn't even see, see where his ball, ball went, did you? To the left of the cup. Yeah, it doesn't matter, mine went in. Did it go in really? Yeah, of course. He said of course. You know why, of course? Because it's a flipping shootout. No, because I've got that dial in. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh, I should have the sponsor dial soap behind me. <laughs> right? A patch on my shoulder says dial. I mean twenty three under twenty three under through fourteen is, is nice, dude. It's nice. Now if you can if you can uh four peat on the Eagles on your way out, I mean that's thirty one under. If ah, you did it once, if and I, it ain't like it ain't impossible. You did it once, if once within the last hour, as a matter of fact. So it ain't like it ain't possible. If keep the faith, brother. If what a shot I could have. The, the only problem, problem the, 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 the big hole that's going to be the issue is number seven. And I did the exact same adjustment. Quarter top, one bar left, and then I did a little bit of curl with it, which made it give me, you know, the extra oomph to the oomph. left I needed. Yep. All right, three point, but it's toilet bowl. So 2.1 is the number that way, so it's all the way about over there. All right. You know, you know what, what I say, where was in London? It is hair was perfect. Yeah, that's right. No, no hitting, hitting the ball great here this time, time folks. No, no hitting, hitting it great. And you're out in the middle of the fairway, which is abnormal. You're normally always to the yeah, left. Yeah, to the left. I, I, didn't put, put, I only put, put one spin, spin to the left. left. And uh, I, I think, think what I did was I absolutely cheated to the, the right, right a little bit. bit. To protect, to protect from, from the, the great, great left, left. Because, because on this hole, it seems to be a great left for me more than a great right. Understood. 
you know, you know how, how mentally you feel, you feel or, or you, you see a game or let's, let's say this game. game. You see that, okay, the, the troubles to the, the left, right? And yeah. for, for some, some reason, reason, I hit it to, it to the, the left in the, the trouble. trouble. Well, why, why does, does that, that happen? happen? Well, well, I don't know. It's, it's just, just a mind thing, thing I, think. I think. Yes, sir. Because you, you don't, don't want to hit, hit it too early because, because then you're really way to the right. So, yeah, whatever. That doesn't matter. There it is. See, it's, it's not, not moving. moving. Really bad. This is, like, my, my game is not moving. It's so gross. Right there. All right, 2.9. Still, I think it's going to miss to the left on this. Uh, mid is 1.5. He's saying good luck in the middle of my setup. Nice, thank you. Perfect. Let's go. Nope. I told you he was going to go to the left. You did tell us that. I had it too far. I had it set up too far to the left. <laughs> oh, Huckleberry saying, watch out for the gopher. <laughs> remember, the, remember the vid he sent us earlier? Hitting that hole and just scooting right back out. Yeah. Halfway in the hole and it didn't stay yep. in. Perfect shot. Ding. <laughs> oh, that's terrible. Yeah, I definitely would have replied with good luck. Good luck. I have a unique set of skills. Right. I will find you and I will kill you. That's right. Good luck. Tell you what, old Liam Neeson is a badass in those movies. In those movies, yeah, he sure is. They well, he was a badass in Gangs of New York, too. Yeah. Love that movie. I don't think Liam Neeson was in Gangs of New York. Oh, but he was, sir. Oh, but he was. I don't recall, but I will not call you a liar. He was in the, uh, he was in the beginning of it. He was Leonardo DiCaprio's father. Oh, okay. I got you. Oh, okay. I remember. Maybe. I think a little bit of that. But he's also one of the ones that's supposed to be in the grave sites. Okay. You know, they, they showed the two graves. Yep. At the beginning of the movie, and then they went back to him at the end of the movie. Priest Valen was his name. Oh One down, three to go. Let's go. Let's go is right, you skanky mamba mamba. Plus ten percent. What did we do? Quarter top spin, one full left spin, put it right on the seam with a little bit of curl to the left. Bam. Oh, you finally dropped this last time, though. Bam. Nice. I picked up this ace on my uh, on my pro round one time. Oh, yeah? But I did, uh, yeah. But I didn't send you the adjustment because I just didn't trust it. I, I, I felt like it was more luck than anything. I gotcha. I would have forgot the adjustment by now anyway, so it don't matter. Right. I never write anything down. I'm terrible about that. Look at that. That would have been a really nice shot if we had that little bit more speed. That would have went in. Wow. Very nice. Oh, wow. Mossy, I just now saw that picture. Sorry, brother. And Mossy's asking you to say Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. Is this an inside joke? I don't know. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. All right, here we go. <laughs> 3.6 is 1.8. That's funny.
and a little bit of curl. And a perfect ball. Let's go one time again. Ho, 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 you son of a bit. Da. I didn't say it. Bit da. It's a bitter pill to swallow, mama. Oh, nice. Let's go, you spamba. We finally figured it out, Troy. After three freaking days, we've got it. Well, I didn't, uh, I was searching mm. through my, uh, Bam! through my golf class trying to find my page, my, uh, my score. What, it, what was the adjustment? Bam! All right. One quarter top spin. One left spin. Hit that first, the second bounce right on the seam of the dark green and the light green squares. And then just half of the ball heading towards the inner power circle, if that makes sense. So if the ball's right in the middle of the power circle, you need to go pull it to the left halfway between the beginning of the power circle and where the ball resting was. So 50% of the ball moving before you get to the power circle, if that makes sense. I'm confused on the power circle. Oh, yeah, yes, 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 yes. Sorry, yes. So... You know, when, you, when it's just sitting in, ready to go, right, you can pull it back right into the power circle, right, and you can rest it in there without moving it, and it sits right in the middle. So if you move it to the left, you can go 1%, 2%, all the way up to 100% right before it touches the inner white power circle. Gotcha. And then without when breaking you touch the line, it, it basically. starts to break, right? Yeah. Yep. So you want to go 50% of resting, 50% between resting and touching the power, inner power circle. Gotcha. Ah, uh, Emily did the same thing on hole 13 as, as uh, Mossy did. They both wound up literally hanging over the edge of the cup. No. Yeah, that's what it looks like. Sadness. Man, that 7 and 16, I need a picture of that. <laughs> right? <laughs> I'm proud of that. I really am. That's nice. I hate to say the word proud and, and put that in the sentence, I'm proud, but I am. I love it. Nothing wrong with a little pride. I'm very happy with that for sure. Well, I got kicked down into fourth place on my uh, on my pro account. We all have 26 under, but above me there are uh, 14s in the qualifying round and 113 in the qualifying round. And so what that's... did you do, 12? Yeah, I did yeah, 12. Mine, mine are all 12s as well. So. It's all right, though. I am yeah. still in there. Yeah, for sure. In the home, I baby. In the that's right. I ain't going nowhere else. Unless, unless, you know, 56 more people shoot a 26 under and have a better qualifying round than me. Right. Or a 46, sorry. Oh, I love hitting it perfect. Damn, I love that. Took off nice one shot. and a half top spin off there and left it right where it needs to be. Yeah, that's the same position you ran last time yeah, when you eagled it. I took um, one and a half top off and I still went about 80, 75, 80% of power. So that worked out a beautiful Well, that was the exact same shot that you pulled off on uh, on 16 last time. That was, you know, before I put baby girl to bed. Right, 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 right. And apparently the same as you did on hole seven or hole eight before oh, I came hole back. Eight, I, I hit it behind, behind the sand trap on the right, 
because I oh, okay. did full, over, full top and full overpower. So. Gotcha. Uh, so there's Max. Min's way back. So Max is there. So we're just going to go just... Look at that bullshit. Right there. So we'll go like two. So what are the wins per ring on a Firefly? I have no idea. No. I'm just trying to hit perfect right now and get this to go in. Oh, the little ring around the rosy shot. Ah. Did it go in? Very nice. Now you're almost guaranteed to eagle on nine, so look at you with the 31. And if you albatross, look at you with the 32, sir. Damn. Thank, Thank you, Emily. Emily. You're, You're so awesome. You guys, guys are the best, best, man. The support that this, these, this group that we have for each other is awesome. Thank, Thank you, Emily. And Troy, thank you. Absolutely. And Jason, and Huck, and Jesse, and everybody else on the stream. It's awesome. Thank you. Yeah, I bet your opponent's upset. They were really close. Maybe he can use a uh, Berserker Ball next time. Maybe. <laughs> Just kidding. That, that was mean. mean. That was mean! Where did I miss this each time? To the right, didn't I? I missed it to the right each time. Has it been to the right or to the left? To the right. Okay. I would love to. I just, I got, I got 170 on the Viper 8 and only 164 on that sniper. It just isn't enough to get there. It just isn't. And I'm not willing to take the chance. And I know that the, um, the rough bump what, with. What the, did you use on 9? Oh, the, the Viper. Viper. Okay. I'm, I'm just, just saying, saying I would love to have a better ball guide and a better one to one ratio, but I only have a six. It just doesn't get me there. You know what I mean? Yes. Yeah, Jay Harv. Absolutely agreed. I'll have to look what he said. He was commenting on your 43,000 gems. <laughs> Everybody gets so mad at my gems. I'm not mad. I don't hate. I do know for a fact that I wouldn't have any clubs that I wanted maxed that were not maxed if I had 43,000 gems, though. Uh oh. No, that's so, so great proof. It's not even funny. funny. All right, cool. I just, I just wanted, wanted it to, to be to, to the right. right. I didn't want a great left it. You know what I mean? Had that yeah. like five bars to the right just to keep it to the right, and I great left it. It was like, come on. It was just, it was just, just a, like I counteracted everything I was trying to accomplish. Super frustrating. I don't, I don't have, have any, any any club that I want to upgrade. You know what I mean? Because they get all the all the ones they want to upgrade are the down and one and the runner and everything like that. So I can't do anything with them. And my Thor's hammer is in the damn store two nights in a row with this account. No, really? And how many gems do you have? One. Four four hundred and forty nine. <laughs> And they, you know, it's in the epic. It's in the epic bracket, so it starts at a hundred gems. So that's max right there. So this is max adjustment. So we're gonna go two and a half back. We're gonna go a half left. Making fun of me, Hank. No, sir. Never. 
<laughs> He's like, how many gyms you got? One? <laughs> You stink! Ah! Not, Not even close. close. Look, Look how, how far away that is. All right. Good round. Good round. Good round. Good round. Yeah, thirty-one under is a, a score I haven't seen yet. So. Thank, Thank you, Jason. Jason. Thank, Thank you, brother. brother. Dude, Dude, I, I love, love the iPad stand. stand. It is outstanding. I mean, the bass swivels, and I mean, the screen moves around. It's 360, 180. It rotates to flat, and then you can move it up and down, all depending on what your your designated angle of attack you want. So it's, it's awesome. awesome. I'm glad. Uh, I'm, I'm glad, glad I bought, bought it. it. Absolutely. Yeah, my tablet stand is a uh, a box with my mouse pad turned upside down <laughs> so it doesn't slip. <laughs> I had to make sure I stopped laughing while pulling that back. <laughs> Thank you, Michael Moss. Thank you, brother. Appreciate it, man. You guys are the best, man. Thank you. Very well played, Hank. Thank you, uh, Troy. Appreciate it. All right, All right, we're, we're going to go to one more shootout. shootout. And, uh, now. We'll Sorry, go ahead. I wonder which one it'll be. Oh, oh he, he missed, missed it. We are going, going to a shootout. Wow. wow. Watch, Watch this. this. <laughs> wow, that's got to be a terrible feeling right there. Yeah. yeah. Now. Remember, somebody else matched your 17 under through 9. If that same somebody else matches your 31 under, we'll know something's up. Who matched it? Do, Do I know? You know who. Yeah, you know. Okay. We'll call him the Golden Boy. Oh, he did? Yeah. Good for him. There it is. So, so what are we shooting on the back? back? Two... Two, four, four, six, eight, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Is that right? Yeah, sixteen and fifteen. Still didn't match my seventeen the other night. Because I had two albatrosses, that's why. I had it on uh, twelve and fifteen. And, and then, then I missed 17. 17. So, so that's, that's why. why. But we, we got, got 17 down in now. Yeah. 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 yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. We'll post, post it to the plan. There you go. Not, Not that anybody's going to care. care. <laughs> yeah, right, we so got a pretty good. we have a very supportive clan. I have to I have to disagree with you about nobody caring. 25 25 28 29 31. Hey, Karen. How you doing, sweetie? Five accounts, baby. Hey, Karen. Thank you. So, so great, great to see you. Oh, oh hey, Ingrid. Oh, yeah, right, right. right. Hey, hey, if you, you want, want me to, to I'll, I'll go, go one more and do a pro. A pro. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I won't. It's, it's midnight, midnight here. here. My, My gosh. gosh. This yeah. has been going on for three hours and 31 minutes. It hasn't felt like that, but wow. It has. Yeah, it really has. Yeah, yeah Karen, Karen. Wow. wow. 31. Played very well. There's, There's the card, card if you want to really look, look at it real quick. quick. We, uh, we ended with uh, four, or four, four straight, straight on, on the front, front ran it up to five, five through ten, on ten, ten, and then uh, finished, finished strong on the last four, four as well. well. Bang, 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 and bang. So, so uh, that's, That's a, a pretty, pretty nice replicated, replicated card. card. If, if we, we would have just, just hit, hit four, four on the front, front instead of messing, messing up with our drive, that would have been, been a, that that been a been nice 32 for sure. sure. 16-16. Well, it's, it's definitely a nice 31, so. Yeah. Yeah. 
Well, well I, can't I can't post this in any of the Facebook chats or anything, or anything like that, or the, any of the clan. Sure you can. Sure you can. No, sure you can. I can't because I'll get ostracized again. We don't, we don't want that. You know what? In the words of the immortal 50 Cent, if they hate, let them hate and watch the gold banners pile up. <laughs> My favorite comment in that little dissertation by people were it was like, well, if you're happy. <laughs> right. <laughs> that was my favorite one. Well, if you're happy. <laughs> like, that is fantastic. It is so great. And then it's like, yeah, come up to Masters and do that. I mean, like, I'm not a Masters player. So why would you even come to comment if you're in the Masters category about a rookie player? It's just dumb. I mean, especially with an extra mile five. Yeah. Well, I mean, how can you know you were using rookie clubs to yeah. shoot your 17 under, yeah. and they were still trying to give you a hard time? It's not like you pulled out uh, an APOC seven. Yeah, right. Well, they didn't know that. Oh, you know what's really funny? And I'm not going to speak poorly of this individual, but I will say this. I saw a streamer today, and uh, someone who's a dear friend of mine pointed me over to that person. Um, so I watched, and this person had, like, a expert banner, right, for his weekly with 3,338 trophies. And he was playing rookie with an APOC 5, an extra mile 8, a sniper 8, a, uh, a, no, a sniper 10, a quarterback 10, um, a Goliath 8. It, it was basically all expert clubs. And he was playing rookie. It was awesome. I was, I was laughing so hard. I'm like, you know what? Go for it, man. Kill it. It was really funny. Did no, they kill I get it? the perspective of people. Now, I would never use those clubs in a rookie, a real rookie account, if that makes sense. But listen, you can't stop people from doing what they're going to do, right? They can do whatever they want. There's no law or no terms and conditions in Playdemix game that says you can't play all the way down in rookie. You're just going to be playing people with the same trophy count and the same, you know, um, weekly banner in rookie. So what? Well, it's just like Tim Granville said to the to the one guy who, and you know, I'm going to go ahead and digress for a second. I have gone back and forth with this guy for a couple of days now. Okay. Yep. He's hilarious. He's absolutely hilarious. I actually like him. I will not be fighting with him anymore. I'm, you know, I made mention about him being in his mommy's basement. So he hit me up at three o'clock in the morning, you know, and 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 had a a rather colorful comment for me, you know. And uh, <laughs> well, I mean, he did. He hit me up at three o'clock in the morning, and, and he had something, you know, kind of funny to say. And of course, I replied. <laughs> He's like, good morning, Snowflake. Well, first of all, I'm the exact opposite of the moniker Snowflake. I don't go to that end of the spectrum, if you will, and I'm going to leave it at that right there. But I replied, well, hey there, doo-doo stain, and I didn't quite use those words. I said, your mommy bring you down some cereal? Now, keep in mind, this guy is from Ireland. He is straight up as Irish as they come. He's like, yeah. Lucky Charms. Man, how can you not like that guy? Oh, I mean, absolutely. That's so, you know, but it, it, Tim Granville responded to him after all the things that he had to say on your post, and he's like, show me the rules that say he can't play right. this way. Yeah. You know? And, and it was very true. Well, thank you very for standing true. up for us in the group. I appreciate that. Well, I mean, yeah. I, I wouldn't. Uh, opinion, I wouldn't be able I to consider it. myself a friend if I didn't. No, you know what correct, I mean? Correct. Yeah, we would all be your defense as well. Always. I appreciate that. Hey, let me ask and you I, Ingrid, I'm, one thing. I'm sorry. I'm sure Ingrid, there'll come you, a time when I need it. Yeah. Well, we'll be there. Um, Ingrid, when you say 20% down, um, are you referencing someone in the chat? Or are you asking us what's going on there with that comment, babe? Or does that mean I have eight accounts and 20% of them are done? No. 
I have five accounts that I've done today, and I still have three. So whatever that math comes out to be. Anybody have a calculator? I do. Sixty two point five percent of my games are done. Three to go. Two pro and an expert tomorrow. And I have no adjustments for any of them. Do you try? For expert? No, for just pro. Uh uh kinda. I'm honestly, dude, I, I use you just do what you do. The majority of what I did stemmed right off of the way you and I play rookie. Yeah, exactly. I, I just adjusted my spin differently. Because, yeah. you know, you know, I, I had to use it I had to use a uh, a sniper on hole one versus the Goliath. So it was like five and a half back spin and one left spin. But I still lined up where my ball, you know, where my bouncing spots were. I think I think we agreed that it was uh wasn't it like four or five squares before the cup and a little to the left of the cup? Something like that. Mama Bull said that... Um, let me look here. Here you go. Wow. I'm, I'm sorry. I thought, I thought they, they were masters. masters. All masters. There they all are. Look at that. <sighs> Boom! Mama Bulls, thank you so much. I missed that totally, brother. Dude, bam. Oh, we are going to rock on pro now tomorrow. Yeah, I think, I think she sent those to me too. Maybe I'm not in my personal chat, but I think she put those in the uh, in the mod chat that we have for uh, GC Attic TV. And I know Huckleberry sent hint, sent us something. Yeah, too. I saw his as well earlier, but I haven't actually opened those because I wasn't playing pro today. So I planned on getting up and getting all of my work done tomorrow, first thing in the morning, and then uh, having afternoon and evening to get uh, these three accounts done and then relax. My birthday's on Saturday. Celebrate with all of you guys and um, have some fun banging out some rookie accounts early morning through early evening, spend the night with uh, my kids and Sarah, and then uh, Sunday bang out the last three and uh, we'll collect some goals. Nice. All right, everybody. It is 12.07, and it is time to say good night. And I want to say thank you, first of all, to Mama Bulls for that awesome um, exchange of information through the, uh, the private message. Thank you so much. I will utilize those moving forward over the next day and uh, over the weekend as well. Thank you for that. Also, for everyone who came into the chat multiple times or have stayed here the whole entire time, thank you for your continued support and all of your comments and your kind words and your support in the stream. Um, let's do this one last time here. Um, Ditto Head, Dale Appleby, Tink Tink, Bethany um, does uh, some content, Jens B does content. We have Terry McKay, he's going to be doing content as well. Um, we have Fun and James. You have Michael Bolton Sr. We have... Who else? Fenzel! Sorry about that, Mr. Fenzel. Um, of course, Tommy. You got Neo. You have RJTV. You have them all. Ian Ballinger. Uh, Ian Ballinger, you got Ehrlich, right? Gaming. You have so many people out there. You have I am Troy, the real Troy. Yep. He does streaming now. So you have a plethora of options out there, right? Masters, expert, pro, rookie. I am just humbled that you choose to spend a couple hours, if not two, three, four, five, come watch my videos. You know, interact in the chat. I'm humbled that all of you come here. Smash the thumbs up. I appreciate that. And uh, our subscribers. So, with that being said, let's do an exit video or audio of our logo. And uh, we will see you guys tomorrow and gals tomorrow for, what do we call it? 
rookie, not rookie, rookie but, but pro and expert. expert. All, right, All right. Good, good night, night everybody. everybody. Have a great night. Good night, everybody. Good night.